Oh, time to get horribly depressed again. Oh, oh, time to get depressed. Time for white society. Woo! Welcome to the stream expand. Anyway, let's just let's just jump right into it, man. Let's uh, just go right into it. Just head first, you know. Time to uh, for some depresso, you know. Woo! Let's go. Okay, let me see. So we did save at this point. I just realized that, uh, the character there was uh, actually Charlotte. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, Eilach. Scarlet Eilach. Wake up, sleepyhead. What? What the fuck? Charles? That's me. Were you surprised? I, where have you been? I looked everywhere for you, all this time. And you look younger. Why? Wait, 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 one question at a time. Like, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is happening? First of all, I've always been here. It's the universe of mind, after all. Oh, so this is just, uh... His mind? Second, I can change shape and form however I want in this place. You what? Don't you remember? We drowned and died. Yeah, okay, so they did go into the water and drown. Then, boom, a universe was born. A universe? I'm afraid I... Come on, Arnold Sheeden. This concept isn't that hard to grasp. Look, the evidence of it is that you're no longer a tulpa. You're your own person now, aren't you? Well, yes, you're right. But definitely strange. Since when did he become so confident in himself? Just so much time has passed since we got separated. It appears that there's a lot that I don't know yet. Yes, you've been in the dark this whole time, haven't you? Don't worry, I'll tell you everything. All the secrets, all the hidden facts. The very truth of this world. Oh, you might want to keep a journal for that, you know. Ah, uh, don't, don't take notes. Don't take notes. I'll. I'll no, I'm, I'm not going to take notes. I'm kidding. Everything is memorized there. I have a photographic memory. But why now? But why now? Where were we hiding all this time? Why? I wasn't hiding. It's just that this will be on the this will be on the test. Oh God, on the trial? You mean on the trial? It's just that I was afraid of approaching you. I'm sorry. Ah, that's right. I did terrible things to him. I was so scared of you all this time. But I'm over it now. Haha. <laughs> Besides, you're not that Scarlet Isle anymore, are you? Right. I want to properly apologize to you ever since I woke up in this world. It's okay, it's okay. No need to bow your head, can't you say you look so noble? I was the one who was acting stupid and selfish all this time. You know, when we became separated, I understood that you were always right. To tell the truth, I'm at a complete loss, so I came to ask for your help. What happened? You see, the current reality is that this world is on the verge of collapse. What? Why? I suppose you're acquainted with Charlotte Wiltshire. I am. What about her? She's the one who's corrupting this world. Everyone's unhappy because of her. She's the one in charge of the public executions occurring on a daily basis. Hey, execution hour is my favorite hour of the day, man. Like, come on. Don't, don't, don't do anything to it. I, I want to see executions every day, every hour of the day, you know? Not every hour of the day, because then it's not special anymore. Once an hour. Oh, an hour a day, you know? She's the reason why so many students commit suicide and get sick with the contagious disease known as white flu. She's dangerous, psychotic, childish, killing just for the fun of it. And it pains me to see my creations in agony. After all, they all are a part of me. But... Even though I'm the god of this world, I'm but a mere observer. Oh, he is observer, okay. Wait, wh who's the creator again? The f that film when your wife ruins your afterlife. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. But isn't Charles kind of his, like, uh, his, not, not headcan, I guess? Something like that? So, not sorry. <laughs> like, I guess so. Like, your own headcan of yourself can be your own wife, like. If I make a version of myself that's like gender bent to being a female, can that be my waifu, you know? Can, can that be my waifu? And then, yeah. <laughs> Probably. It, it, has science gone too far? I can't do anything against her. But I can. Is that what you're trying to say? It's just that I'm no one to turn to. And so being so useless. It's went to, to anything as possible. Indeed, indeed. Leave it to me. What should I do? Oh, that's easy. All you, need to, all you need is to sabotage your story. Eh? Listen, the reason why Charlotte Wilshire acts like this is because she constantly feels paranoid of her audience. She despises interactive storytelling and doesn't want the puppeteer to play. That's why your target should be the audience. 
And not just Wiltshire herself. Oh, shit. Is she gonna start attacking me? Is she gonna pop off the screen like the girl from the ring? Or is she gonna come from behind her? I, fe I feel like I should lock the, lock the door now. Before I get fucking assaulted by uh, this fictional character. After all, she's not nothing but a mere puppet. Albeit a self-aware one. Puppets, audience, just... What is happening in this place? But what can I do? That's easy. You're the members of our past, don't you? I do. Then show them to our puppeteer. Were they uh, to learn that the truth of this world was this pathetic? They'd stop supporting the story and leave it on their own. Wait, is the game gonna try to make me leave? What? <laughs> that's that's all the concept I've, concepts I've been, ever taught about, I think. Yo, let, me, let me see now. What game what what type of game have has tried to make me leave? Maybe a Dotail genocide, maybe or something like that? Like it's getting super hard, you know, in that run, so that you you don't want to complete it, you know, because you're like, ah oh, fuck, this is too hard, you know. But I can't really mm, oh, is there something else? I can't really think about something else that's uh, like where the game makes you want to want to stop whatever you're doing, you know. Can't really think of time for a steam refund. Oh shit! But I played more than two hours though, so that's kind of a problem. And as a consequence, Charlotte Wiltshire will stop hurting others. Genius, isn't it? I can rely on you, right? Of course. Leave everything to me. I'll make everything right. Oh shit! I'm gonna stop playing so. Or I'm assuming this happened before everything with Charlotte happened, so... At what feels like an eternity, I open my eyes again. The vivid imagery of Charles past is still clouding my eyes. Yeah, so I'm gonna assume that happened before she attacked Charlotte, you know. The vivid imagery of Charles past is still clouding my, my eyes. The growing nausea, nausea is becoming too overwhelming to bear. Where am I? Ah, this must be the white society room. Oh, the irony. More importantly, the camera's on. You're awake, huh? You're finally awake. Eilar. It's time for the show to start soon. And you're the star. Ah, I see. Allah must be planning to execute me publicly in order to make an example out of me. This is our way of becoming everyone's savior. This is the end of you, well, end of you, Wiltshire. You won't plague this world any longer. <laughs> I'm <laughs> just kidding. You must be thinking you're one, Scarlet Tyler. But you're wrong. I went along with the flow because I wanted to. You know? Oh, this music. You know, Charles never shared these memories with me. Even though I thought we were friends. But now I know that what he's been hiding. You've been a great help. Thank you very much. And guess what? I'm certain now. That you deserve a fate worse than death. But you're the abuser here. You're childishly cruel and psychotic. It's you who should pay for your sins. I'm saving this world from you. Miss Eilar, this place is made exclusively out of Charles Eilar's soul data. The damage I cause is limited to this mind space, and consists entirely of Eilar's thoughts and experiences. I'm no more than a puppet with a customizable body and soul. I was born to kill and be killed for everyone's entertainment. Hey, it's pretty entertaining though, to say. That's a weak no- wait. Trying to cross the border. <laughs> That's a weak no you. <laughs> That's a weak no you. I was born to kill and be killed for everyone's entertainment, all for the sake of making a story. However, you, you're a monster. Nonsense. Are you saying nothing counts if it's fiction? Eh, we're not having this discussion. I'm saying you should stop with the bullshit like saving and helping. When you were the reason everything became like this to begin with. Moreover, even after this death, you trampled on father's feelings, you made a show out of his memories. That, I cannot forgive. Not in the fact of you being his tulpa excuses your actions. Uh, I'm not his tulpa anymore. I just, I just want to make things right. Know what? I don't care. You already ruined everything. If you really want to stop me, should I put an end to the mass production of all Charlotte's in the house? But all you did was drug me, assault me, kill me, and make a laughing stock out of father. You call him worthless all the time, but you're the one who won't amount to anything. Oh hi, still going strong? Yeah I am. Welcome to the Sremos already. We're getting to the... pretty close to the end there, man. You call him worthless all the time, but you're the one who won't them to anything. That's why. I use Mother's power. The ropes fall off and my wounds get healed in no time. Even if there's no free will in this world. Even if there's parasite controlling our minds. Those things don't really matter. All I want is to end this once and for all. This is my wish. Look at you, scared shitless. What the... Here's some Charlotte trivia. 
Each one of us is a part of Mother inside our bodies. And guess what? Mother is, is, is this world's true god. She's the one in control of everything. She bestowed each and every Charlotte with a gift. A power that can grant a single wish. A power so spectacular that it's only fitting for story ending. Oh shit, is she gonna use the wish and ruin the whole thing? And this is where I completely lose the plot. <laughs> and I used it just now. Wait, what? This is ridiculous. But that's how it is. And now look at what's coming for you. Uh oh, I know what I should do. What do you? Oh shit, what the fuck? <laughs> Oops. What the fuck? Is she killing her? You failed from the very start. First rookie mistake, underestimating your enemy. You thought I was stupid, didn't you? Well, of course. You think everyone's more stupid than you. You thought a side character like you would have a chance against the protagonist? You retard. Jesus Christ, the language. <laughs> uh, Charlotte looks at you. What is a secret, darling puppeteer? Oh, I want to know a secret. Thank you. I was aware of your presence all this time. Oh, shit. Makes sense. Although, if you reload the game, you know that already, don't you? I wasn't really hiding it, but did you really think you could fool me? Although, you're probably here just to watch, so I can't blame you. Oh, oh, I wonder if you're not actually playing the game, but watching someone stream it instead. What the fuck is this Doki Doki shit? Uh, I'm kind of scared now. Sh sh should I exit the game? Uh, okay, let's just proceed, let's proceed, let's... Uh... If that's true, you're a pretty lazy person, aren't you? You, you guys are being called out. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Can't confirm. <laughs> like, I'm lazy too, by the way, but Jesus Christ, man. If that's true, you're a pretty lazy person, aren't you? You won't even worry of being called my puppeteer. It's what the person who cared about that will say. Ha! Besides, you might be not a Windows owner to begin with. Did, did they send some Windows because it's like trademarked? Besides, you might not be a Windows owner to begin with. Then it's all our fault. We're deeply suffering the means. Wait, is the game not available outside Windows? Hold up. I gotta check that afterwards. However, whether we're alone or not, I won't be the one to feed your ego. Leave that to the other puppets. Speaking of puppets, what'd you beg for your life? What, why should... Scallop spits on my face. What? Okay, that was janky. Yeah, but... Is she spitting on my face or spitting on... Scarlet's face? Go to hell, load of pest. Mm, okay then, we'll be back in a second. Okay. Oh god, it's execution hour. <laughs> Please stand by. Time for execution hour, let's go! Last time I got interrupted. Welcome to the... Was this the one I remember being on? Let's see her. This probably gonna be awful. Because she tried to ruin it. This program is supported by white society. All hail. Hello, dear friends. So sorry our previous show ended on a sour note. I'll make it up to you by making today's show the most spectacular show ever. What the fuck? She looks like a fucking god. Can I just... A again, like, I know I mentioned this last time, but this song... It's a bop. Like, I'm gonna listen to this song after I'm done with the game. I don't know why, it's just such a bop. Meet this week's special guest, Scarlet Isla. Like, look at her, she looks like she's in pain. So much pain. And uh, Charlotte looks like a fucking god. I, I know she's got an oracle inside her, but Jesus Christ, she looks so fucking haunting. That. She's the reason none of you want to get up in the morning. Fuck you, Scarlet. Fuck you. You're the, you're the reason I can't get up in the morning. I feel like it's a little louder now. Different pieces on show. Oh, should I just uh, turn? Uh, I feel like it's louder now. Different pieces on show. Hmm. I can probably just check, check my stream. Hold on. Uh, just uh, take a minute to see how that gets tonight. It's kind of loud, yeah. Okay, you know what? I'll just uh, turn it a little bit lower. But the music here is pretty loud, loud too. Like, I had to turn my volume pretty low. There. Is this better? Okay, it's, a, it, it's really. Come on. L loop song. Come on, loop. Is it better now? Seems better, okay. Good. But yeah, the music is really loud here. But uh, it's a bop, you know? So, it is what it is. Okay. <clears throat> She's the reason none of you want to get up in the morning. Fuck you, Scarlet. Fuck you. You're the reason I want to get up in the morning every night. Uh, every day. Fuck you. Fuck you. 
She's the reason you don't get good marks in class, aside from the obviously faulted education system. Fuck you. But wait, I, I do have good grades, though. Oh, I did have good grades. I, I, I don't go to school anymore. I work. Do you think you're gonna finish the game in this stream? Uh, yeah, I think. I think I'm gonna I'll finish. Yeah, I'll finish it in this stream. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I'm all, I was beyond the halfway point in the last stream. So, uh, I couldn't be wearing my Omori hoodie. Hell yeah! Omori hoodie, let's go! Just the reason for everything bad to happen in your lives. God damn it, Scarlet. Am I biased or am I biased? Who cares? She's the ultimate scapegoat we will ever have in this place. I almost feel bad that today's show will have to end. But not after that. In today's show, we'll make a puppet. It's so exciting. Wait, is she gonna become a puppeteer? Sh Charlotte is gonna be become a puppeteer and uh, and Scarlett's gonna be become a puppet. Holy fucking shit. Imagine if we play as uh, Scarlet and uh, we we get choices, but we get don't get to decide because we're not a puppeteer, you know? Like, what the fuck? So exciting. We will need Scarlet Eiler and a giant blender. Oh. First, we'll need to take Scarlet Eiler and put her into a blender. Oh, God. Now add some mint essence, a frilly Lolita dress, some spit, and push the button. Whoosh! Jesus Christ. And voila! Here you go! A splendid puppet! That's... I wouldn't really call that a puppet, that's just... That, that's just a dead body. This is what happens when you become tainted with ugly colors. Holy fucking shit. I sure do wonder how well, well this heap of meat will burn. Let's leave that for the next time, Werner. Shut up, please. Thank you for watching. Stay white with us. Okay, I'll stay white. Just don't put me in the blender, Charlotte. Whew. Well then, that's done. <coughs> uh, no way, this early? I stumbled and fall, unable to keep my balance. I feel sick. There's no strength in my limbs. I should probably fix the volume now again, I think. I think it should be around there, right? Because uh, it was just a volume in the other... In the other scene that was pretty loud, right? So... Let's see, they feel them and foreign. <laughs> Too bad. I wasted my wish on that idiot. If you get your wish granted, your story will end immediately. Didn't I warn you? Charles would say. In the end, I couldn't stay white, huh? I hear footsteps. It's of course... Of, it's of course it's him. Looks like it's the end of your story, isn't it? Unit Q84. Hold up, what? Q84? Modern network power overuse. Drug side effects. Everyone wants you dead. All of that must have sped up the process, huh? I laugh bitterly. It sounds borderline hysterical. Too bad your body and soul have an expiration date. Soon to be deleted and disposed of. How was it in the commercials? A new story, a new Charlotte, in this brand new installment. What kind of girl will she, will she be? I'll stab you. <laughs> so dangerous. Charles lifts me up from the floor. His embrace is gentle, as if he's holding something fragile. Disgusting. I'll miss you, you know. Mother never sets your intelligence parameters too high most of the time. Because of that, I've spoiled you too much. You know far more than the other puppets. That's right. You never shut your mouth. Guilty as charged. I'll be with you in your last moments, Miss Protagonist. <sighs> Are you afraid of death, Miss Wiltshire? No. But, you know, after you told me about the nature of the house, I couldn't stop thinking that everything is ultimately hopelessly meaningless. I thought this was in the end of the game, huh? I don't fucking know, man. I don't fucking know. Yes, but that's when I thought... Why play nice if I'm just a disposable asset? Why forge relationships with the NPCs? Why care? It's a matter of minutes until my soul cube self-destructs. Everything is pointless. It's all your fault. I know. I thought I'd come up with a witty comeback. But all that comes out is gibberish. Uh-oh. Looks like it's be better if you didn't try to speak right now. It'll be okay with Miss Wiltshire. What in the world is he talking about? Just what is going to be okay? Feeling the last bit of strength, le strength leaving me, I lean on Charles. As much as I want to smash his head against the floor right now, having someone to lean on doesn't feel so bad. I close my eyes and try not to think of anything. Looks like it's the end of my story. Looks like it's, it really is the end of her. Oh, it's Umbrella Man. You! You? Shouldn't it be father? Pa no. It doesn't matter right now. Hmm. So that was Umbrella Man is actually Charles' father. Hmm. 
Interesting. Kind of makes sense because of the ice. No, it doesn't matter right now. Q at the four, she. Is there, is there really nothing I can do? Ah, oh, how cute. Tiny God's favorite doll just broke. The only pure white one became contaminated in the end. A pity, isn't it? Please, can, can you save her? <laughs> I'm afraid there's nothing I can do at this point. Look at her, she's decomposing. Were you supposed to have misophobia? Although I can see how much you want to throw up right now. Make sure to take a shower after this, okay? Shut up! As for the alternatives, there's a story where uh, Charlotte also became self-aware, albeit without your guidance. Coincidentally, this is a story I and the puppeteer are going to experience soon. Want me to get you that puppet as a replacement? No, it won't be the same. What the fuck? He, he wants this version of the puppet? What? He wants the white society puppet? Uh, uh, alright, man. Uh, alright, alright, alright. Don't kink shame. Alright, 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 alright. I ain't. But what if kink shaming is my kink, though? Huh? Huh? Can we talk about that? No, it won't be the same. Well, there's another option, though, too. You see, the player has the save files of this puppet's soul data. So you can try loading them into a Charlotte vessel. Okay, I have no comeback to that. <laughs> but it will be seen as an error by Modern Network, so I wouldn't recommend it. Unless it's a defective vessel, of course. Oh, I know. How about we use a Vincent vessel for? Those are hopelessly suicidal anyway, so it's a win-win solution. No, she'll kill me for it. I'm pretty sure all the Charlottes are predisposed to be fascinated with them, though. She was different. She was... different. Oh, was she really? Well, in any case, I'll leave you to it. I have an audience to entertain. It would be a waste if the story ended here, after all. Chapter 3 end. Let's all kill a Scarlet Isle. Wait, what? Nani? Wait, what? Disposable soul. Wait, what? Hello, Charlotte. Episode 0 end. What, Nani? I quite a special item. Seize observation journal. Would you like to save a purple soul there? Sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember how this works now. Uh, I'm kind of confused. Would you like to continue? Sure. Well, aren't you eager? Unfortunately, there's not much left to do in this place. So we'll be leaving it shortly. As you may have noticed, this Charlotte wasn't the child you want to save. I hope- I sure hope not! Oh, did you actually like her more than the Charlotte which have you been with for so long? Q84 is more important, let's go white society, let's go! No, I'm- I actually want- I'm actually kind of- I'm actually kind of split because, yeah, she was an asshole, but she was a likable asshole. Hmm. I didn't actually think about that. That's like, what? Wow. Yeah, yeah, but it's only a game, though. It's only a game, okay? It's only a game, okay? It's only like, it's only a game. It's only because it's a game. It's because it's fiction. It's not real, okay? That's the only reason why. Like, I really enjoyed the uh, execution hour, okay? It, it was my favorite time of the day, you know? Hmm. I also liked how self aware she was. And how, uh,. And how, uh, uh, fucking, what's the right word again? Uh, she, she, like, uh, compared to Charlotte, uh, the, the, my Charlotte, the other Charlotte, she actually had some courage, you know, to uh, speak against the flow and stuff, you know? She was actually leader compared to my Charlotte, which was being pushed down, you know? Now I've seen that option. I wonder what the changes. Changes, hmm. Guess we'll find out afterwards, because I'm, I'm gonna pick my Charlotte, okay? Because... I, it's, it's been a long time, like, I, I just saw Q84, you know, and I, it's been a long time since I've seen my Charlotte, so let, let's save her. My Charlotte is more important. Just like I thought. The Charlotte you met first is the one who matters the most. Well, aren't you loyal? You must have many questions as to why... Why have I led you to this particular store to begin with? But do believe me, it's vital to understand everything that will happen from now on. And I was gonna tell me that was my Charlotte, you know. That twist. The twist can be that was my Charlotte. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Surely didn't think that we were going to travel in time and change the outcome of prior events, did you? Because if you did, that would be rather unfortunate, after all. Like I said before, there's no such thing as rewinding time in the house. One story ends, a new one begins. It's an endless cycle of life. You know how it goes with games. You can always start a new one. 
System mode, initializing, new story. Please activate it manually from the title menu. Wait, did I... Hold up, I, I just gotta look if I... Did I press new story like when I played the, the, uh, the first one? Or like the... Uh, hold up, let me just look at my footage here. Let me see. Did I click new story when I played the, the first one? Let me see. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, okay, I did click new story, okay. Like, I, have the, I, I just had it on my desktop, so it was pretty fast for me to ch just check if I did... If I did click new story when I played it, you know, so... Alright, I guess we're gonna click new story? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Or do I load back and pick the other shot? Like... I'm, I'm gonna guess I'm gonna click new story. One way to find out. Alright, new story. Let's go. Let's see what's... In the works. Alright, new story. I did mention that I have to start a new story. That's it, that's actually intro. Oh! What the fuck is that? The world is clad in white and red. The awakened one sings a song of hate from despair. I don't remember this. As she drains the color from the breathless bodies. That's not all, Charlotte. This deafening cacophony of pain screams, I say a silent prayer. Hello Charlotte, episode 3, Childhood Sent. Okay, at least this one is the right one. I think. The monstrosity hovers above me, sneering. Let's play hide and seek, shall we? I'll give you three attempts. She sings songs, caressing my cheek. I feel something crawl into my ear. But I'm frozen in terror. It's futile, futile to resist. Run, little girl, she says. Let's meet where mother is. Is she mother? Is our Charlotte mother? You know? Fuck. Okay, she's bleeding. Oh shit. <coughs> I have to hide. Oh god. Is it gonna be a horror game now? Do we have to hide? Okay, there's someone dead there. Is that Charlotte? Or is it just someone that looks like Charlotte? Like, here wise, you know? Aren't those the white society notes? Let's see her. No way. After threatening me, she... What the hell? You don't have the right to be dead. Not after what you've done. The absolute freak show. Wait. Psycho. Is this happen... Is this some... Okay, I'm gonna guess this is happening before she got blended. You know? Put in the blender. But... Charlotte is now dead. Because it looks like she still got stabbed, you know? By... Uh, Charlotte, or like mother, psycho, murderer. No, no, she can't be dead. After I've seen what she's capable of, no, it can't be. I've seen her die before multiple times. Hey, you, you here, right? The one who's pulling the strings. Confirm if you are. Can I pick something else? I don't, I don't want to confirm. I don't want to confirm, man. Let's just, let's just exit the game. Let's just exit the game. Let's let's ruin everything. Okay, let's just confirm. I see. It's just as you said then. You really do exist. Please, please help me find a place to hide. My injured and Wiltshire might be still looking for me. I can't afford to die here. As she... As well... Skull of Womans on the floor. That monster. The only problem is that I have restricted access to all the areas in the house. However, now that we have this corpse, this might not be a problem. Thankfully, I only need I. Jesus Christ! We need a box cutter. Oh God. Oh, well, at least I don't have to carry Charlotte's body around, like, uh, weakened at the burnies, you know. Ah, disgusting. Let's go to the elevator. Something's never changed. Indeed, indeed. System notes. Switching control strings from Charlotte to Scarlet. With Scarlet's minimalist world view, you'll be able to see the house in a new light. Ooh. I'm kind of scared now. Everything's going to be different now, probably. No, okay. Everything seems the same. Can I not check the notes? Okay, let's... That's uh, an eye scan, huh? Here goes nothing. Initial eye scan. Eye scan, successful. Alright. Well, I just realized the 11th floor. Can we go to 11th floor? We need to go to 1F. I've never gone there before, but... Now that you're with me, I think we'll be fine. Please, sorry. I'm gonna curious what's on the 11th floor, though. Destination reached. Oh, right. If you plan to stick around, how about I give you tasks from now on? I'm sure it'll be easy to navigate that way. So, new task. Find a way to enter the room from 1F. 
We can't go back to 2F. So this is the only place we can hide. Oh my god, look at her. She's so cute. I look at the ga gallery. How many pictures do I have? I got 45. Holy fuck. Have I missed any? Let me see. Let's see if we missed any. Seems like I've gotten everything. Okay, I'm missing the... I'm missing 10. Okay. That's cool. Let's just save there. Wait, wait, let me see. How, how does it look like now? Four minutes. Okay, okay. No cats. Yeah, man. No cats. Wait, no cat. Hold up. No cats. Why are there pictures of cats? I mean, they're cute, but... Also, do you have the stats book? Oh, right, right, right. Let me see. Seas Diary. It's also cats. Indeed, they are, apparently. Seas Diary. Unit Q84 Observation Diary. Let's look at it. Seas Diary. Let's see. Read the journal. Sure. Log 1-245. Daddy deleted. Log 246. As a rule, all the Charlottes have a parasite in their brains. Unit Q84 is a special case. It's safe to assume that she might be a defective unit, as there's no traces of the parasite in her brain. As a result, she isn't acting according to the program. So far, the defective units have had different deviations, varying from having hermaphrodite bodies to being physically or mentally disabled. Well, she was kind of mentally disabled. I'm here to inform if Q84 has any of the disabilities common to most of the defective units. Log 247. Let me see. Fuda Charlotte. Yo! yo. Fuda? Nani? Did she have a penis? Hold up. Did I miss something? Did I miss a line there that... Where did you get Futa Charlotte from? But isn't that just technically Charles? Hermaphrodic Charlotte's a scary thought. Hermaphrodic. Oh, is that, does that mean Futa? Kinda. We know that they have a penis. Or does it mean that they have both? Both a penis and a vagina. Log 247. One of the common themes in the stories is that all Charlottes are perpetually abused without fighting back. I presume it's a way to create an emotional connection to a character. As soon as Unit Q84 learned about it, she immediately took measures to fight back. Yeah, she did. On the sixth day, I think? Yeah, all... Yeah, all the goods. Yeah. Fully equipped. She stole the samples of white flu from the workers, laboratories, and deliberately infected all the students who posed a threat to her. Moreover, she found the white society which... Oh, she founded the white society which exists for the sole purpose of lowering the population of the school. She's planning to use mob mentality as a psychological weapon against the students themselves. Log 248. Ever since Q... I like the fact that we're reading this while it's having like a little bit of music. Ever since Q84 learned that she cannot die until her story ends, her mind state has become more unstable. Whenever she gets badly hurt, she immediately ends her own life without a second thought. I think it may not be not wrong to assume that she's afraid of dealing with the long-term consequences of injury. It's the only way to read. Yeah. Oh yeah, with the elevator music. Yeah, man. I think it may be not wrong to assume that she's afraid of dealing with the long-term consequences of injury. Log 249. How many are there? Out of all NPCs, Q84 seems to have taken a liking to Henry Bachel. However, all she does is push her around and make her laugh at her own at her jokes. This story Miss Farrell is quite timid and vulnerable. So I can't help but feel sorry for her. But I keep reminding myself that she's not the Andrew Varrell I knew. Log 250. Holy fucking shit. As much as I hate to admit it, I don't think Q84 will last for long. Her obsession with the color white is almost religious, which is quite worrying. Moreover, Q84 doesn't seem to have forged meaningful relationship with any of the tenants. However, she does experience loneliness and subconsciously longs for attention. I will be there for her. Oh, okay, there, there it ended. Jesus Christ. Wait, am I bleeding? Oh shit, I'm drinking blood. If I just run around, can I bleed to death? Soup! Yeah, you mean Charles? Yeah, yeah. Or C? C? Vincent? Whatever. But can I bleed to death? Let's go! I want to bleed to death. Okay, this, it seems like only a few pad... few tiles I can actually bleed on. Cool. Soup! What if you have cats? Camera, huh? Who's watching us, I wonder? But why, why, why can't I run? Like, she's bleeding and shit. I want to bleed to death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The biggest kink. What's the quote chat boss when you need it? I want to bleed to death. Enter the vent shaft? Uh, wait. Let me see. This door's locked. It's locked. Damn it. This lock has speech recognition. We can't go past there. Let's bleed to death. Yes, 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 yes. I'm dying. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, let's bleed to death. 
Anyway, let's uh, go through the shaft. And then we'll show them my shaft. It's a storage room. A cup of blood. Uh! Ah! S sparks start to dance before my eyes. This room will do. I think I can rest here just a little. Oh shit, I'm gonna sleep to death. When I open my eyes, the lights blind me. Have I died? Oh shit, Felix! You have 10 seconds to explain yourselves. Uh, uh, yourself. Otherwise, I'm activating the security system. Well, you see, there was an evil Charlotte, and I disabled her, and uh, then we start the new game in this video game called Charlotte. Oh shit, I've run out of time. Never mind. Otherwise, I'm activating the security system. No, I'm fairly sure the afterlife doesn't have pink haired midgets threatening me. Hey! Hey! Don't do that to my homie, man. 10, 9, 8. Shh! I caught the boy smart from my hand, silencing him. <laughs> She's scared, look at him. He looks so startled. Quiet! She might hear us. Excuse me, what? What? Whom are you talking about? Charlotte Wiltshire. Do you know her? I do. So? Is she here? No, she isn't. She hasn't come home yet. Home? Oh god. Oh no, I have to run. I uh, abruptly get up, only to win some pain. Can you ki kindly calm the fuck down? <laughs> uh, is it the first time he's sweared? I don't think he, uh, he's sworn it yet. Can you kindly calm the fuck down? Which I isn't here, and I'm not here, her associate, okay? Ah, uh, my ass. Keep your language in check, will you? Really? You're bleeding to death, okay? You're bleeding to death. And you, you, you're thinking more language? Who are you, Captain America? You're in no position to lecture me, miss. I treated your wounds. Where's my thank you, Mr. Honecker? Oh, where's my thank you, Mr. Honecker? Oh, he fixed my wounds, never mind. Honecker? As in Felix Honecker? Uh, yes, so? I once read a novel with a character named that. Not again. Yes, yes, and I now read it too. Let's never talk about this again. Ah, so that was a sensitive... Oh, so that was a sensitive subject. It's nice to meet you. I'm Scarlet Aller. I saw being rude earlier. I just panicked. I... Alright, alright, I understand. What did you do this time? What do you mean? No, it doesn't matter. Short Bullshire murdered every single person on the second floor. Oh, that takes some talent. So you're the sole survivor? Yeah, she wanted to play hide and seek, so she let me go. She's seriously messed up. Saying things like, I'll meet you where mother is. What could it possibly mean? She couldn't have possibly met my mother, because my mother is kind of beautiful and understanding. Do you have parents, Miss Annika? I'm not so sure anymore. He turns away, his voice becoming eerily quiet. I decide not to press him further. I have an uncle, though. I see. Say, are there any other people on this floor aside from you and your uncle? Hey, hold your horses. The fact that I've attended to your wounds doesn't mean that we're on friendly terms now. Why should I trust you? If anything, we should quarantine you in case you brought contagious disease from the second floor. I'm fairly sure I'm not contagious. Like I said, we can't be sure. No one here is allowed on the second floor, Wiltshire excluded. So, you've never been to school? School? What's that? <laughs> my wounds were treated by a kid without a degree. <laughs> God damn it. What good would a piece of paper with a signature do you? Look, you aren't coughing up blood anymore. Isn't that evidence enough? You're right. I'm sorry. Never mind that. Sleep for now. If you do anything funny, Mr. Bennett will break your neck with a TV remote. How the f- Break my neck with a TV remote? This Mr. Bennett sounds like a scary person. Yeah, man. He's pretty scary, man. If you try to leave this room, the doors will burn you to death. But I'll bring you food so that you won't starve. Have any preferences? No, not really. Alright, I'll be back in a few hours to check up on you, Miss Adler. You are patient for now, so rest assured. No one here will harm you. Okay. I want to believe him. Mr. Honecker leaves the room. Oh. Let's see now, my fear. What's gonna happen? I stare at the ceiling. Hey, Puppeteer. Thank you for helping get there. Actually, something kind of wholesome in this game for once. Yeah, man. Good, good point. I I did not realize that. I've been... S s like, the game has been drugging me with all this... Uh, unwholesome stuff. That's finally something super wholesome happened, I, I guess. I love this whole part. Yeah. Yeah, man. Felix is, Felix is wholesome. Felix best boy? Or was it Bennett who was best boy? No, wait, wait. wait. It was, it was uh, Vincent. You know, Vincent was best boy. Never mind. Take him back. Thank you for helping me get there. You know, see... See, Vincent, the guy who jumped off the building, he's best boy. Thank you for helping me get there. It worked out somehow, didn't it? It's obviously Aiden. He's best man. Best man. Alright, he's the best man. 
it worked out somehow, didn't it? Like, I, I will pick him as best man if I ever get, if I ever got uh, married, you know. I will pick Aiden as my best man. I just know that he will be there for me, you know. E e even, even in bed, you know, like, <laughs> fucking hell, that's not wrong. Like, e even when we're sleeping, you know, like me and my wife, he will be there, you know, watching over us, you know. Oh my, <laughs> it worked out somehow, didn't it? You, you, you understand what I'm saying, right? Beast in bed. No, 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 not beast mode. I was thinking more like when you suddenly got antlers, you know. Like he would be there for me. I feel, I feel, I, I feel safe around Aiden, you know. Because he's best man, you know. It worked out somehow, didn't it? I think I need a name to refer to you by. How does Lilith sound? I will put a set. Uh, let's play Lilith. I should. I should I, I wanna uh, pick. I wanna pick the name that she uh, came up with. That feels weird. Nah, let's just pick Lilith. All right, Lilith it is. What's my mother's name? <gasps> you know, I have memories of the true realm. It's a place that's nothing like this world. In that realm, I didn't even have a physical body of my own. Nor was I my own person. Here, everything changed. But even though I, I have these memories, I don't feel a connection to them, as if they don't belong to me anymore. Or perhaps they didn't in the first place. A kid born to Lilith and Seth explains his whole mess. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Or perhaps they didn't in the first place. Still, I feel like I should apologize to the person Scarlet Adler of that world hurt the most. However, no matter where I look, I can't find them anywhere. Sorry, I'm rambling my, t my thoughts. I need to rest. Good night, Lilith. Good night. Would you like to save progress? Oh, shit. Hmm. I think I'll just start saving the on these three, you know. I'm actually just save on this one, the first one. You know, I'm just gonna continue going downwards because I do want to load back to this one afterwards, file 13. Because I want to see what happens if we pick Q84 Charlotte, you know. Anyway, let's save her. I dreamt of piles of bodies soaked in red. With Charlotte Wiltshire sitting atop them. With me, Scarlet Eyler. Oh, find me, Scarlet Eyler, she says. Let's meet where Mother is. You sure that's 13? Already has Scarlet Sprite. Wait. Uh, yeah, but I looked, at the, I looked at the hour. You saw it on the fact that it said 3 hours and 46 minutes. Worst case scenario, I'll just load the one before that, you know. Hmm. Let's meet where Mother is. Pushing me down, hovering above me, Charlotte Wiltshire is crying. Hmm. I wake up in cold sweat. What am I wearing? What's that screen clothes? Or oh yeah, she's wearing like uh, sick clothes, you know, the ones they wear at hospitals. In cold sweat. I wake up already. It's a Hanukkah. Morning, Miss Adler. So bad dream. More like a nightmare. Isn't that the same thing, bad dream? Nightmare, is that the same thing? I have to find Wiltshire. Eh? Why so sudden? Weren't you hiding from her? I just remembered something. Huh. And well, after you finish with my treatment, I'll have nowhere to go. Everyone I knew is dead. One wrong step and the doors will evaporate me. And now Wiltshire's plaguing my dreams. I'll find her and get it over with. How do you plan to do that? And when you find her, how are you sure that she won't kill you? I haven't thought about it yet. But I want to understand her. I'm afraid the logic behind the decisions is kind of wonky to me. I can't understand you. Stand, you weren't there. She's not human. Charlotte Wiltshire is a monstrosity. Monstrosity. She had her hair turned into enormous meaty appen appendages. Did she stab the room with it? Yeah, man, that's... That kind of reminds me of that one villain from Powerpuff Girls, you know? The one, the one that's got, like, that lovely hair. You know? She had her hair turned into enormous meaty appendages. Did she stab the room with it? Yep. Of girls. As if a tumor grew on her body. Wait, appendages? A tumor? I might know what you're talking about. Please follow me here. I'll uh, help you get up. Take the IV with you. I slowly get up and follow Mr. Honecker. Ooh. Let's go. Damn, I'm walking with the IV thing in here. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Bro? What is this? Organic matter infected with the parasites. We were able to extract it out of Miss Wiltshire while she was sleeping. Meat meat. Yeah. Meat meat. Killed her in the pro process, but she respawned anyway. 
But there's a whole pool of it. I know. After we obtained the host, it kept growing like a tumor. We're able to contain it because the host isn't sentient in any way. It's a viscero... Viscero complex? Which is basically a brainless mass of organs. So. so the sentient host to feed on. However, this parasite can manipulate the fabric of time and space. I call it the Oracle. What the fuck? This is where the Oracle comes from? This is like the genesis of the Oracle? Oh. If it's this powerful, then... Can I... Become a host? But uh, what? You gotta be kidding me, right? Were you listening to what I just said? Yes, I was. I'm fairly sure this is the same parasite that Wiltshire used to cause the massacre. If I become a, its host, I'll be able to... Did this sleeping pills impair your thinking process? Miss Allah, it... It's basically suicide. I want to agree, but all that comes out of my mouth is... It doesn't matter. Huh? No, I... Find me, Scarlet Allah. Just... Please. I have to find Wiltshire no matter what. I need the Oracle to face her as an equal. No, no. What in the world am I saying? If you say so. I like the fact that he's just allowing me to do it. Huh? He agreed? We only met yesterday and now we're friends. So I'm not really in any position to argue. Besides, I uh... No, it doesn't really matter. I'll do it, so let's go. What? F Felix gonna do it? No? Or is he just gonna allow me to do it? By the way, she seems to be quite knowledgeable about what Wiltshire. I've been monitoring her for a while. Have you ever seen anyone die a gruesome death and have an exact copy of them walk in like nothing happened a minute later? There's something seriously off about that. Right, I thought the same way. Plus, Miss Wiltshire herself is mentally unstable. She seemed to be adamant of the conviction that all the house's inhabitants are NPCs. NPCs? Non-player characters. Apparently she strongly believed that this world is a game. Is that so? Yeah man, this ain't a game. This ain't a game, man. This, this is real life, okay? This is happening right now. In the universe. Is that so? That's ridiculous. Although what she said about puppeteers was true, so what if? Quit playing games from my heart, indeed. We need to take one of the vials from the cabinet on the left. However, we can visit the Oracle pool again if we want to. Although it is gross, I find it strangely fascinating. BRB, alright. Wait, are we not... Here it is, God in the jar. What the fuck? It seems empty. It's a parasite, of course you can't see it. However, it's desperate for a host. Despite being this small, it's extremely powerful. Still, it might drive you crazy. Eat you from the inside. Are you sure it's worth the risk? No, I don't want this. I have to find Wiltshire. I'm scared. I have to find Wiltshire. Please, let's call it off. I have to find Wiltshire. It is. If you say so. Let's get started. Alright. What do you need to do? I'll operate, I'll operate on you and insert a part of the oracle into your brain. Let's go. Jesus Christ. I have to put you to sleep first. It's a brain surgery after all. Drink this. Okay. Will you manage by yourself? You do not believe my abilities, do you? Sorry. I can't help but be skeptical. I know. There's no guarantee your brain won't reject the foreign substance. And your mind too. You might not recover after this. I prescribe you uh, suppressing drugs to prevent the parasite's rapid reproduction, but I can't promise anything. Nothing about this is fine. Find me, my mind supplies. Fine, I have to find Wiltshire. Let's start then. I close my eyes. Hey, you're shaking. Are you scared? I'm not. I am. I feel Felix Honecker reassuringly grip my shoulder. I'm so pathetic. I squeeze my eyes shut, try to calm down. But then a thought occurs to me. I'm no longer alone. For the first time since I woke up in this world, someone is here for me. Even if I make a mistake, there's someone to guide me. Even if I fail, there will be someone to remember I existed. Lilith is here. Indeed, I'm here. I'm here, my child. See now. God, imagine if she just wakes up. Oh, God. Oh! What the fuck is this? <laughs> well, well, well. What do we have here? Oh, God. A cute little mind library. <laughs> Jeez, what the fuck is this, all these noises? You will deny it, but you in fact believe that we are some kind of a god. A Deus Ex Machina to help you achieve your goals. But more than that, you're terrified of us. Terrified of Charlotte Wilshire. Say, how did it feel to watch all your classmates get turned into minced meat? They all were oh so nice to you. But bullied Miss Wilshire all the time. Why is that with one, though? 
And it was not ordinary bullying. After all, her story wasn't R-rated for nothing, was it? Just look at all those camera angles. It's all her fault, you s they cried. You knew, yet they yet did nothing to help. Because the truth is, you didn't like her at all, did you? Treating everyone like NPCs. She just got all these noises, Jesus fucking Christ. Treating everyone like NPCs, putting herself above all of you. Miss Wiltshire was really unpleasant, wasn't she? I tried to speak, but all that comes out of my mouth are pained sounds. Aw, oh, too bad you can't counter, counter our speech with a witty comeback, right? Alright, we don't mind giving you some freedom of speech. <coughs> Dorkle waltzes around the place, falling apart and reassembling all over again. Hey, class rep. What is that determination to find Wiltshire? Are you sure it's not my control? I don't know, but I'll find her and make it clear. I couldn't understand her during her lifetime, so maybe I'll understand her in her afterlife. She seemed to know something I didn't. That art, man. Yeah, I know, the art is... That was really good. I really like it. <laughs> Are you sure you'll succeed at all? I'll succeed no matter what. With Lilith, it's possible. Made a deal. Oh, how lovely. How can you be so sure that your puppeteer can be trusted? It seems like you're quick to trust each other. Each, each passing stranger once they are even... Wait. It seems like you're quick to trust each passing stranger once they are even remotely kind to you. For all we know, they might be on Wiltshire's side. They're with me now. It's all that matters. They might be simply curious. It's not like they're deeply invested in your character, having known you for a few hours. Charlotte is everyone's favorite girl. And look at you, you're obnoxious. That's a sad pepper right there. Look at that sad, or oh, sad people, you know. Look at them, look at her, she's so sad. Keep quiet. You're just a pest. Sure, sure, we'll just shut up. Dorkle falls apart again, turning into a pulsating mass of organs. I lay down on the floor, curling into a ball. It's okay. I can do this. Would you like to save your progress? Yes. Let's save her. What's gonna happen? I'm gonna wake up now. Oh shit, we're awake. Morning. How are you feeling? <coughs> My head hurts! Get it off! 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 Get I feel like I've heard this before. Was this at the start, maybe? Get it off! Hey, easy. Wait a moment, I'll run a quick test. Hmm, as I thought, this is bad. Your body is rejecting the parasite. Oh shit. Yeah, same. Don't know where, though. You won't last for long. Hey, girls. How much time do I have? A week, maybe less. Can I do anything about it? No. Congrats on getting meat cancer. <laughs> that, that, that's one thing. That's one way to put it. Meat cancer. And for how long do I have been that? Thanks, Felix. <laughs> Imagine somebody giving you cancer. Like, holy shit. Like, or technically she allowed him to give him cancer, you know? Always there when you need him. Yeah, man. <laughs> it's such a weird line, like, Congrats, you now have meat cancer. <laughs> and for how long have I been out? Three days. We moved you back to the storage room after the operation. We? Oui. I talked to Bennett and Florence. They agreed to cooperate. I see, and Wiltshire? Still not back. I can assume she might have left to another floor. To find her, you will have to go up. Then, second floor should be out of the question. I doubt she will go back there. Hmm, that might be true. We can narrow down the places by detecting the ones with anomalies. Oh, that would be of great help. Let's go then. Florence will help us with the coordinates. She's a tech specialist there. Follow me. She's probably on the 11th floor. Just you know. And check something. No. It's kind of weird that she's telling me that I got tasks and shit, but still not that. The task menu is so useless. Like, it was, it was useful in the first game. I think episode 1 was one game where it was useful, but afterwards it's been completely useless. Or maybe it was the start of the second game. But it's seemingly completely useless in this game. Like, holy shit. Wait, how many do I have now? I have 47, okay, okay. Getting close. We're getting close. Let me see. Let me just say that. Let me see. Uh, he looks so done. Yeah, look at him. He's like, god damn it. And she looks so... She... Scarlet looks like someone with meat cancer. Like, look at her. Like, if you Google meat cancer, a picture of Scarlet pops up. By the way, don't Google it. Just, just trust me, bro. Source, I made it up. You know. It came to me in a dream. What the fuck is this? 
just did. <laughs> Biohazard is waste inside. Loss of red meats. Oh shit. Biohazard is waste inside. There are various surgical tools and ant antiseptics inside. Can I go in here? It's locked. Do not, does Felix not have the key to his own room? To, come on, man. I want to look inside the... The Oracle meat... Cancel thingy. Anyway. Childhood's end. Oh, I read all of this. Camera's bubbling inside. I don't think there's anything... I wonder if you can look at the computer if you delete all the files. Like, I did not delete the files, I remember. But I wonder if you can do it if you if you actually did delete the files, you know? Because you could collect- you could delete all this research, research, you know? Hi, I'm Florence. Please make your acquaintance. Different timeline. Oh, okay. wait. Yeah, I guess this is different timeline, right? Maybe. I don't fucking know. It seems like everything is the same as yesterday. But the only difference is the- is the fact that, uh... The Scarlet didn't get uh, put in the blender, and uh, and uh, Charlotte became still became a god, you know. Scarlet figure, I don't know, fucking know. Maybe she made another wish, you know. Hi, I'm Florence. Please meet your make your acquaintance. Ah, hello, Florence. I'm Scarlet. So, Felix said you accepted the Oracle vol voluntarily. You'll die in a few days, right? Oh uh, well. Florence, please have some tact. Bro, you literally just just told her congrats. You now have meat cancer. Like, come on. What do you mean by, do you have some tact? Ah, sorry, sorry. So, you do want me to find the coordinates of places with power anomalies detected, right? I found four. I sent the data to your PC, Mr. Honecker. Since the meat cancer guy. Exactly, exactly. Meat cancer guy be like, Hey man, you gotta have some tact, man. Like, but... <laughs> okay, you know what? Felix is now just a, uh, just a meat cancer guy. Felix, meat cancer, uh, Honecker, you know. Oh, meat cancer guy, Honecker. Good job, Florence. You can always count on me. Fuck yeah. Let's look at the laptop. Midix. Yeah, Midix. Matrix. Midix. Good luck out there. Thank you. Let's see. We detected the signs of Wiltshire's presence on the fourth floor, sixth floor, ninth floor, and eleventh floor. The first dimension is a language land. It's located on the fourth floor. Alright, I'll be going then. Wait. What is it? Your condition is still unstable. Are you sure you'll be fine on your own? I don't need any help, and I don't trust any of you. What the fuck? You just let him put meat cancer inside your head, and now suddenly you don't trust him? We know what is to each other. Indeed, however, you won't be able to operate the elevator with your level of access. We, however, have access to the floors from 4th four, floor to ninth floor. Ah, damn it. He's right. Why don't we go straight to 11th floor, by the way? There's a problem with that. Everyone can, anyone can go to 11th floor, but no one comes back. It's the point of no return. So strongly advise going there last. Fine, I don't have the time nor the strength to argue. Just, let's go already. The sooner I find Wiltshire, the better. You don't care about anything else, huh? I'll be going with you this time then. Let us depart. Let us depart. Let's, let's make haste! Have a safe trip, you know, Sounds like a fucking adventure. Fuck yeah, look at this. Listen to this elevator track. By Jane. Destination reached. We're now on the fourth floor. Let's go in here. The elevator's doors... Oh, the elevator's doors slide open. And something rushes in, completely filling the room. Get yeah, wait! What's that? What's that? Gas? It wasn't me. When I regain my consciousness, I find myself gasping for air. Suddenly, my mind becomes filled with arrangements of letters, words, sentences. It's suffocating. I open my eyes after what feels like an eternity. What the fuck are we? Where? What the fuck is that? Is that an angel? Like a realistic uh, or a Bible accurate angel? That's scary. I'm sorry. I don't really understand what you're saying. The saying that they saved you from drowning. It's the language of the old world. Honecker, you're okay. Well, duh, I didn't lose consciousness like you did. Where are we? In the Logos village. It's located in the dimension inhabited by anthropomorphic languages. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. <coughs> we don't have much time. My scanning device has detected Miss Wiltshire's presence outside of the village. Alright. Wait, what did you say right now? Uh oh, looks like you got affected. What? Try saying something. What the fuck? <laughs> Is she got affected? 
Just like I thought, it, it must be because you're almost drowned in the world. World C. World C? What does it mean? Is there something wrong with me? Yeah, well, you got the local version of a cold. Pros, you'll be able to understand the language. Cons? None, really. It works off after a while. Ugh, great, another disease. Hey, don't insult it. If anything, it's the fastest way to learn a foreign language. You want- I want that- I want- I actually want that disease now. I want to know- I want- I just want to be able to speak every language. Freak Pokerus. Pokerus? What the fuck is Pokerus? I'll Google that. Pokerus. Pokerus. What the fuck is Pokerus? Pokemon virus? What? This microscopic life form that may attach to Pokemon, first bearing the gener gener generation second games. Someone's gonna watch this and get that. Someone's gonna watch this and get that. Yeah. Is this like a manga thing? In the games. Hmm. The manga. Does it make the Pokemon be able? Does it make them able to talk? Is that it? Or does it make it uh, so that the uh, people can understand the Pokemon's? Maybe. I don't fucking know, man. Anyway, if anything, it's the fast way to learn a foreign language. I'll bet temporarily. Oh, never mind. Alright, fine. How do you happen to know so much? This device but it's entirely beneficial so everyone tries to get infected. What the fuck? I don't happen to know. I've been studying these flaws for a while. I thought of them as dimensions at first. But it would be more correct to refer to them as floors. Is that so? You're quite dedicated, huh? I just want to be like uncle, is all. Anyhow, try talking to the person who saved you. Alright, let's try to talk to them. Thank you for saving me. You are welcome, dear guest. Our purpose is to ser serve, you speaker serve you speakers. Feel free to ask me anything. About the world, I'm more curious about that. The sea used to be our home. It gave birth to all of us. But then, we evolved and conquered the land. However, as of late, our people keep returning to the sea. They leave without saying a word, and never come back. Uh, about this place? Welcome to the village of dying languages. Nice. Do you guys speak uh, Latin? Currently, all the languages are on the verge of extinction. So we ended up uniting our lands. So we're the only village left around there. Oh. Cool. Villagers. Each villager has a gift. The full knowledge of a specific language. Before, we had multiple representatives of each language. Now, each language is singular. Why so? Did something happen? Yes, something happened to the world sea. My friends disappear every night. They leave the village, as if something is calling them. Then, they never come back. I think I understand now. I'm sorry, but how can, can, how can we get to the sea? Hmm... Do you want to disappear too? No, we want to find out what's causing the disappearances. Right, Miss Arnaker? Yes, I'm sorry, but we can't stay here. Ah, is that so? You have to pass through the gate to get there. The gate, huh? Are there any special entry requirements? If you solve the riddle, you will pass through the gates. Oh my god, it's a riddle! The Riddler. I figured it wouldn't be that easy. May you be blessed by the prison. May I grant you its light on your journey. Here, have a cookie. We'll cheer you up. Yep, this is where the puzzle plot starts. Yeah, we can't wonder about that. Like, the first and second game are puzzles. It's pure CBT, lol. It's pure CBT. Cock and bolt, also. Acquired fortune cookie. Then it. New task. Leave the village. Let's do our best. Did you just tell me what the task was? Find a way to leave. Uh, just leave? Bro, bro, just leave. Oh yeah, I got a fortune cookie. Find a message inside, okay. We crack open the fortune cookie. It says... Zero equals nine. What kind of fortune is that? Acquire a message inside the cookie. Alright, let's read the message. Hmm. No, okay. Can I go this way? Oh god, what the fuck is this? Okay, we're inside a tree. What the fuck? Is this like the Great Deku Tree? What the fuck? That's kind of cool. Hmm. Is this part of the puzzle? Zero equals nine, it says. Hmm. What the fuck is this? The prism is important. This is such a wacky game. <laughs> sure, you can come in. Wait, is this the same one as the one on the inside? Is this a gate? 
If you can solve my riddle, I'll let you pass. What four letter vault becomes short if you add Wait, what four letter vault becomes short if you add a second letter to it? What four letter vault becomes short if you add a second? If you add a second letter. What do you mean by second letter? Do you What four letter vault becomes short if you add a second letter to it? This couldn't get any easier. Here's your answer, it's... I hate the clues all around the village. Please find out all the clues first. There's more to this person than you might think. Oh, okay. Guess I gotta go and find the clues. May the prism grant us life. May the prism grant us love. Grant us hope. Logos can mean both word and discourse. Oh, but discourse is a quarantine word. What? Logos can mean both word and discourse. Oh, but this goes to quarantine world. I'm so confused, man. Christmas kind. Christmas wonderful. Oh, Christmas warm. Christmas hope. Can I touch it? Christmas important. Christmas bright. Let's not enter people's houses without our permission. Hey, man. I can do what I want. This is... This is, I'm playing, okay? I can if I want to walk into random people's houses like an RPG, I'm gonna I might fucking do that, okay? Yeah, yeah, now he suddenly let me. Like what the hell? What's the sign say? This wants ex exhibition mind. Mind. Read the instruction set. <laughs> like I'm, I can I can see a little here in my eyes that's kinda of annoying. <laughs> let me see. Read the instru introduction text, sure. A body, clumsy, uncomfortable. Gendered, uncertain, sexual, repulsive, a mind, a bucket of fears and flaws, and intrusive thoughts, wonderful and god awful. They do not match, yet form a whole. Oh, yet form a whole. Let us admire the imperfection. Exhibition by Charles Eiler. Ooh, that's a brother. Welcome to the gallery. Here, you can have two tickets. <gasps> oh my god, I got a gallery ticket. Let's look at it. The exhibition is rated was R rated. What's that little F thing? Three visitors allowed at a time. Well, uh, we are technically we're three because it's uh, Felix. Uh, okay, I forgot the name. Scarlet. Fucking hell. How did I forget the name? Suddenly, suddenly my, my brain just stopped. And I was like, what the fuck was the name again? But yeah, Scarlet, Felix, and me, Lilith. You know. So technically, we are three people. The disorder. Read the poem. Sure. They thought you were pretending. They thought you were kidding. They thought they'd be playing along. Believe me, I do know that you you're not a liar. Hmm. Oh yeah, this art was cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool art. Anorexia, bulimia. Read the poem. Eating was wonderful. Eating was awful. Eating was blissful. Eating was sorrowful. Eating was joyful. Eating was mortifying. An apple a day. Couldn't you keep the hunger away? Death of personality. Read the poem. To you, whom I no longer know, there was no other choice. Just one can stay. The other has to perish. Once you have failed. Right, a failure. That's what you are. You couldn't. You haven't. You didn't. You weren't able. So let me gently lower you. Into a tub of acid. Watch your slow dissolve as I put it on your skin. That's kind of creepy. There's no doubt I'll be the one. Thought yet another failure. Ooh. That's kind of hot. Plankson, read the poem. Listen, dear child, we'll split the pill in two. One half for me, to make me want to get out of bed and work myself to exhaustion. Second half for you, to calm your heart and suit your fears. No one will notice we're not the same. Hmm. Is that like a little jab at the fact that you've got one part that goes to work and another part that's relaxing? I don't know. Is that refer referring to the deaths of Charlotte, the third one? Hmm. I'm gonna read that one again then. Obsessive compulsive. Read the poem. Wash and repeat, it's not enough. Wash and repeat, it's not enough. It's not enough, it's not enough, it's not enough, it's not enough, it's not enough. Okay. Death of personality. Let me see. To you who I no longer know, there was no other choice. Just one can stay. The other has to perish. Once you've failed, right, a failure. That's what you are. You couldn't, you haven't, you didn't, you weren't able to. So let me gently lower you into a tub of acid. Watch you slowly dissolve as I put on your skin. It's no doubt I'll be the one. So that's yet another failure. Yeah, maybe. Because you did a cool poem, bro. Yeah, man. Pretty cool. Pretty hardcore. Welcome to the gallery. Enjoy your stay. Thanks. 
Can't leave. Something wrong? I'm fine. This place makes me feel sick. Hmm, what's this? Is this another? Without praying that the prism will inevitably disappear. Oh, what? Well, is this something? Without praying that the prism will disappear for sure. Cool. Now we go. Oh, wait. Can we go in here? Hmm. Okay, nothing different here. Oh, did that look different? Let me see. It's kind of half in the middle there. Let me see. Let me look at the uh, the other one. Let me see. Is it? Or does it look exactly the same? Yeah, okay, it looks exactly the same. Anyway, let's continue exploring this uh, village. We're deeply sorry, speakers. The quarantine is off limits. Quarantine? Yes. Here we keep the words whose meaning was tainted by the speakers, so they fell ill. Only time can heal them. That's why this is not a hospital, but a quarantine instead. They don't have the concept of medicine, huh? It's more like there's nothing they can do. We peek inside of quarantine. Ah, what the fuck is happening to that thing? Ah. Cool. So they're, they're always in pain. Cool. And the prism can't just life. Can't just life. Can't just life. Can you grant me a uh, Chick fil A? It's okay. I'm not sad my friends are left. Hmm. I feel like, this, I feel like these rooms have something. So something to these rooms. Like, why else is it possible to go inside? I'm not sad my friends are left. Maybe it's just trying to throw me off. All my friends disappeared into the sea. You can come in if you want to. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's a journal lying on the floor. It might have something useful inside. We flipped through the journal. Look to the page titled The Riddle. There's only one sentence written on it. Let's write it down. I quite a clue. Can you find a clue? Let me see. Four is an upside down perpendicular, it says. Well, did it say what four. Was it a. Uh, what four. What word that's. Four letters wrong gets shorter when you add two letters. Was, was that a little riddle? Something like that. Let's not enter people's house with permission. Sh shut up, let me, let me do what I want. Let's see if we can talk to this guy here. Let me see. Let's see if he says I've found enough clues. If you can solve my riddle and let you pass, what four letter will become short if you add a second letter to it? Ah, you want the final clue for the riddle, right? Here you go. What a simpleton. Hush. I quite a scrap of paper. Ooh. The final clue. S equals... Is this an S or 5? I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's an S, right? S equals 8 is written on it. What is it? Or is it 5 equals 8? Hmm. They're all letters. Hmm. Zero equals nine, it says. Zero nine. Four is an upside down perpendicular, it says. Okay, let, let's just uh, see. Here. What four letter? What four letter? What four letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it? Let me see. The word becomes short. What do you mean by short? Hmm. Hmm. Zero? That's fine. Never mind. Let me see. Okay, let me, let me look, look, look at it again. What does it mean perpendicular? What the fuck does that mean? I gotta Google that. Perpendicular. What's the meaning? Let me see. A tangle of 90 degrees to another line of s or surface. Hmm. Does it just mean angle? No? Like, when it's upside down, it becomes like an angle? I'm kind of confused. There's an upside... Four is an upside down perpendicular, it says. Maybe? F five... What is it? S equals eight. Let me see. What do I think? Let me just write... Ah. Three is... Let me see. Zero equals nine, it says. Or I just write all these numbers. Hmm. 
It's a letter O, no. Wait, what? It's letter O? Is that it? O equals 9. S equals 8. Hmm. Really? It's kind of weird. I kind of wish... I kind of wish they made it more obvious. Like, it looks like... Both of them looks like letter. Or like numbers. S equals 8 is written on it. O equals 9 instead. They could have picked something less ambiguous, yeah. Mm. Okay, let me just think now. Mm. Mm. Oh, wait, let me see. Exhibition is written R. Let me see. Hmm. Hmm. That is said, that was it. Prism is important. Sure, you can come in. Hmm. I feel like I need to go back and maybe look at the exhibition. Like, are there any, clu are there any clues to the puzzle here? This month's exhibition mind. Come see. Or is this everything? Is this everything I need to solve the puzzle? Or are there clues somewhere else? It's kind of fun. Wait, what is? Is there a clue in there? Or is there uh, or, is, or is this everything? Yeah, let me see. This is all you need. Oh, really? Really? Does something wrong? I'm fine. This probably makes me feel sick. Okay, let me see. Okay, okay. Okay, so I just have to big brain this. Hold up. Hmm. Come see, let's leave the village. Come see, wait, 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 come see. What is it? A four-letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it. A four-letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it. What do you mean by second letter? What do you mean? I'm sure. What? Four-letter word. I'm sure to add a second letter to it. What do you mean by second letter? You're going to slap yourself once you figure this out. Probably. Probably just fi think it's a... Uh, hold up, fuck off. No, fuck, fuck off. It's probably just uh, these numbers, right? Probably just these. Like, uh, let me see. It's already the F3 is a lot of the time. Mm. It's probably just like... Oh, wait, let me see. S equals 8, so... QS... Yes, I know. Hmm... Hmm... Alright, the trivia is a lot of time. O equals 9. What the fuck do you mean by that? Four letter word. Okay, there's a word that's got four letters in it, but it becomes short if you add a second letter to it. What do you mean by add a second letter? What do you mean by second letter? Like, it, it, it's like four letter word if you add a second letter to it. Like, how, that doesn't even make any sense. I do not think that makes any sense at all, because wouldn't it be if you add another letter or something? Surprise, this has used them after cruising through them before. Bro, I just feel like the the, the way they are word, they're wording it is kind of weird. Let me see now. Yeah, hold up, hold up, hold up. It's just confusing. Maybe it's deliberate? Hmm. And the fact that, like, the riddle, 4 is an upside down, but... Let me see. I think now. S equals 8 is written on the... What the fuck does it mean? That was... Because this was the last... Hint, right? Let me see. Mm. A small hint. There's two puzzles. What about the numbers later? There's two puzzles, okay, okay, there is a puzzle somewhere else. What? There's a puzzle inside here. Both at the gate, but yeah, both at the gate, what? 
sold the f sold that first. Which one? We're talking the gate. How, how am I supposed to talk to the gate? Was there another gate somewhere? What do you mean just by by the numbers? What four letter word? Like what four letter word becomes short if you add a second? You can ignore the numbers for now. Try figure out what you need first. What do you mean by that? You, <laughs> you're not. Ah. Uh... You can ignore the numbers, but I I can't. I I need to know a number, don't I? Oh, this is just... That's wrong. Okay, uh... Okay, I know the solution. Know it. I'm just, I'm just gonna do this until I get it right. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding, kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna do that, that's... That's boring. Hmm. Ah yes, brute force, indeed. Indeed, I've done it before. Okay, let me just think first. Let me see. There's two puzzles. Yeah, you gotta figure out what word you're using first. The numbers come after. You gotta figure out what word you're using first. Okay, so it's just a random word that I have to figure out. A word that's four letter. But what does it say second letter? What does it mean about second letter? What does it mean by that? Like, there's already. If it's four. If there's a four. If there are four letters in a word, you can't say what happens if you add a second letter to it. If, don't you mean a fifth one? My explanation skills are failing me. Same, bro. Same. Like, I fucking suck at this shit. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. But don't give me the answer, though. Don't give me the answer, I'm just saying. Read what she says. Take it very literally. Read what she says? Do you mean her? What four letter will become short? Become short if you add a second letter to it. A bit late. Let me see. What four letter words? You mean? Do you mean just the letter? Do you just mean uh, the number four? Or if you add a second letter to it, but how does it become shorter then? What do you mean by six? No. What four letter will become short if you add a second letter to it? What do you mean a second letter? Four letter word. Ten? No. What four letter word becomes short? Four letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it. What do you mean? It's such a confusing way they are, uh, t are t giving me the puzzle. If you add a second letter to it. Do you mean a second number, you know, because... Do, do, do they mean, like, what number? What four-letter number becomes short if you, shorter or, like, less if you add a second letter to it? Is, is that what you mean? Like, I'm so confused by this. But that doesn't make any sense. I got it immediately. Ha ha ha. Fuck. You smiled at me. Shut Ah! Hold up, let me see. Ah. Uh, what four letter words? Interesting to see how that works. You, you nailed the logic. You nailed the logic once I got stuck on. Yeah, but. I might just be overthinking it. L like I said when I did those puzzles. Like some some of when I get presented with like really like uh, convoluted questions, I usually get them. But when when they're sim when the when the puzzles are simple, I get stuck like hard stuck. But I feel like I've heard this puzzle before. What four letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it? It doesn't make any sense that there are led that there are numbers to it. I feel like it's so confusing when there are numbers to it because I was thinking, oh, the the. Like, yeah. uh, for example, the word uh, long, you know, that's four letters. But if you add a letter to it, it becomes short, you know. Like, I feel like that makes sense, but... Does it help if I reword it? Maybe, maybe. Perhaps. 
What's four letter word becomes short if you add a... What do you mean by just in height? What four letter becomes short if you add a... What four letter... What four letter... Four letter word becomes short? Do you mean like in height? It becomes short in height? I don't feel like that makes any sense, man. What the fuck? It becomes short in height. Let's see. A thousand. Oh. You are way overthinking this, probably. Yeah, yeah, but I feel like the question doesn't make any sense. Fuck! I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to <laughs> end the game this stream because I'm still fucking stuck. But I also don't, I also want to be able to figure it out, you know. So it's like, fuck. But am I supposed to? Is this everything I need to be able to figure it out? Like that, that two, uh, that those two lines. Is that everything I need to figure out the uh, puzzle, the riddle? I don't need one of the uh, other things. That's the most important part, yeah. Hmm. But uh, do one of these help? O equals nine. S equals eight. Frozen episode. You can know the numbers now. But you told me to do the number. You told me to. Mm. But what do you mean by board? Oh, this is just my mind. Oh, no, wait. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Oh, okay. I was thinking, like, if you, if you, like, turn the four number sideways, it becomes, like, an N, maybe? I don't fucking know. Hmm. Maybe not. Hmm. Nine equals O S O O S S O uh. You wanna fuck it. I've been stuck here for like over five minutes now. You want just just tell me, okay? I'm I'm sorry. I I failed you, okay? Like if I've been if I've been streaming this all alone without an audience, I'll I will just sit there and try to figure it out on my own. But the fact that I have someone watching What's the second letter in short? H? H? There's a second letter to it. Short. It's an H. What's the second letter in short? H? Is that four? Like upside down is four? Is that it? What four level becomes short? That's wrong, no. If you add a second letter to it, what? Comes short. Oh wait, wait. What four four letter word becomes? I just realized. Four, 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 four. Like what? No. What? Yeah, but I was thinking like what four? Oh, this is just four. No. I'm confused. What do you mean what? Do you mean? Uh... Are, are you confused that that was the solution, or are you confused that uh, I, I didn't realize the solution? Let's see. What's the second letter in short? It's H. An H upside down is like a 4, you know? I was kind of thinking that, but... And 4 is a 4 letter word, you know? Becomes short. Or is it... Let me, let me see. S equals 8, right? And then 4. And then 9? No? Fucking hell. Was it 8, 4, 9? I feel like you're so close now. Yeah, same. Let's see. 8, 4, 9. That's wrong. No. The numbers won't help you. The numbers won't help me. Okay. What do you mean, though? What four letter word becomes short? If you add a second letter to it. I'm still so. Hmm. Oh, let me see. 
Uh, did this sales not help? Like, you will think it will help since Schwartz, like, there's an O there and an S there, you know? What do you mean by that? Throws an upside down perpendicular, it says. That's kind of confusing. I feel like these are hint stores, this one. Let me see. Oh, wait, let me see. S. Wait, let me see. Short. S H O. Is someone went to R and T now? Let me see. S was eight. H was four. Then nine. I'm so confused. Yeah, another hint. Hint. So, the, uh, what do you get when you remove the second letter from short? Sort. But didn't they say add? What for letter word becomes short if you add letter to it? Sort. Sort. What for letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it? Sort. If you add a second letter to sort, and that letter is an H, it becomes short. Yeah, okay. If you add a second letter to sort, and that letter is an H, it becomes short, okay. But, and then, so, let me see. So S and O, so that means 8 and 9? Was it, was it 8, 9 here? That's wrong, no. Now you can use the notes. What? I'm confused. S equals 8. O equals 9. Let me see. If I have a second letter to sort and that letter is an H, it becomes short, but... Force an upside down perpendicular, it says. So does that mean, like, it's, it's a 90 degree? 90 degrees? Is that something? Because... Confused. Now I can use notes. Wait, what? Let me see. Okay, let me see. Sort. Eight. Nine. What about R and T? I'm confused. Eighty-nine. What's wrong? But what for letter word becomes short if you add a second letter to it? How is how this helping? Cookie message. O and S. Sort. Hmm. And there's an R there. And it's three. Upside down perpendicular, it says. Uh... Confused sort. Anyway, let's see. Just eight. Wait, what's the nine? So that's fine. Let me just see if I'm able to. That oh, fuck. That's fine. What's the four? Very well. You may leave speakers. I don't feel like I solved anything. How, how, how was, how, how was the T in sort 9? Sort 8, 9, 3, 4, yeah, but, okay, so S equals 8, 9, or uh, O equals, let me see, can I kind of guess the 4 because all the other letters are equal for, but a capital T upside down, oh, because it's 90 degrees. Bro, you can, no, no, no fucking way I would have gotten that. No fucking way I've gotten that. This, that's a puzzle that I will never have gotten in a million years. Like, holy fucking shit. Oh god. Okay, so... For, uh, okay, I'm gonna take a picture of that. I'm gonna guess I'm gonna follow that route, you know? Okay, I'm gonna go up four times. One left, three up, two right, four up, two left. Then, then three up. Let me see. I think it's the fourth thing either, but it's easy enough to guess from the other three. Yeah, 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 I can, you can guess the last one, but like, Jesus Christ, man. 
That's definitely one of the most complex passwords I've, I've fucking I've found. Fucking blah. When the fucking. I won't show me the fucking picture. Come on, just. There we fucking go. Okay, okay. Let's see it. Isn't this too much to memorize at once? I have a folding up memory, so it won't be a problem. But let's write it down in case. I quite the memo. I challenge you to run the directions without looking at the memo. Heh, <laughs> challenge accepted. Let it. New task, reach the end. May want to save. Probably. How much time do I waste? Oh, it doesn't say anything. Oh, wait. Alright, so it's actually been a half an hour since I saved. Cool. Maybe I was stuck for half an hour. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking remember. Okay, but let me see now. What the fuck is this? Oops. What's this? Nothing? Okay. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I didn't realize. Please try to be careful. I'm only one life. Oh, okay. It's from the line. I didn't realize. I, I thought I could just walk. Okay, my bad. One, two, three, four. One. One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, two, three. Nice. Oops. Well done. You did without using the memo. Here, have an achievement. Thank you. Brainiac or just a cheater? I'm a cheater. We're getting close. Already? Yeah, the source of this dimension's anomaly is up ahead. Face yourself. <gasps> oh my god, it's a boat! Get in the fucking boat! <laughs> Sorry. I had to do that little reference. Oh my god, I can speed. Wait! <sighs> Skip some text. What do you plan to do when you find my I want to talk to her. It was clear something she knew about this world I didn't. To be told, I don't understand a lot of things about this place. So much different from what I was used to. Different in what way? Uh, well, this place just doesn't make any sense. The only place even remotely resembling the realm is the school. I never left the second floor because of that. It was the only place where I felt safe. But Wiltshire level leveled it to the ground. I have no place to belong to anymore. Okay, hold up. I'm gonna go the title and load back because I missed some text. Okay, you know, I'm gonna do that. Okay, okay. Let me just see. I'm gonna see if I can remember this now. 4, 3. 4, 3, 4, 3. Okay. Then it's... One, two, wait, one, two, two, okay, just like, wait, was it four first? Yeah, okay, wait, one, two, two, okay, one, two, three, four, one, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, three, ha, ha, I did this with us. I did it without looking at my phone. I remember it now. We're getting close. Already? Yeah, the source is mentioned on my so bad. Press yourself. Okay, I'm not gonna hold in the running button now because I skipped some text. I didn't realize that we're gonna come text there, okay? I'm curious what the text is. Say, Miss Aller. Yes? What should you want to do when you find what's there? I want to talk to her. To clear something she knew about this world that I didn't. To be told, not on sell out the thing to this place. It's so much different from what I was used to. In the right way. Uh, well, this place just doesn't make any sense. The only pla place even remotely resembling True Realm is a school. I never left the second floor because of that. It was the only place where I felt safe. But, Wiltshire leveled it to the ground. I have no place to belong to anymore. Yeah, man. That's sad. Anyway, let's continue. Are you nervous? I'm fine. The sooner I find Wiltshire, the better. I wonder if we'll discover the secret behind the disappearances of the villagers, too. Hold on tight. And so we got sucked to the pitch black vortex and died. Or did we live? Did we ever live? Uh, my head hurts. Miss Annika, are you okay? Yeah, I sort of. I uh, should have worn a hazmat suit. We're underwater? Suddenly, Felix's features become tense. Miss Annika, look up! I do as I'm told. And the scene that unveils before me is. What the fuck is that? Wait, was the scene made out of people? That's kind of messed up. Imagine drowning in people. Oh, maybe not. What is this? Looks like we found the missing villagers. They're all tangled inside. It appears that they were absorbed into this thing, whatever it is. Can we still save them? Well... Halt! You cannot go any further. Who are you? I'm the guardian of the world, see? I protect the great cluster. 
This is how it should be. The great cluster, Cladog. The, wait, there's a cluster of Cladog. Or, or was that just a misspelling from, uh, from a Scarlet's end? The pure white one came and unified us. The pure white one became the core. Thus brought our and her wish. The pure white one. Ah, that's of course Charlotte. Is this about Wiltshire? Where is she? My hypothesis is that there's more than one Charlotte of Wiltshire in the house. Ooh. More than one? How can that be? She so Wiltshire lived on our floor, never went to the fourth floor, did she? True. However, there is something I don't understand. Why are you guarding it? Is this Vault Cluster the reason for the extinction of your people? The Great Cluster is not the cause. It is a consequence. Can't you tell us what's going on? I think I get it. The Great Cluster absorbs all the existing languages into it and unifies them into one. And um, this floor's Charlotte will charm must be in the center of all of it. She's the core of the Great Cluster. The Guardian nods in approval. The core? But why do this? Aren't your people suffering? This is how it should be. The speakers are hurting. The speakers want to understand each other. So we will endure for their sake. Looks like we've come across a purely and altruistic civilization. Why does it have to be like this? The villagers aren't happy about it. If anything, they're all depressed. It does not matter. We exist to be used by the speakers. If they want to hurt, we will become their weapons. If they want to deceive, we will become their shields. If they want to connect, we will become their bridges. If this must be achieved at the cost of our lives, so be it. This is how it should be. Let's go back, Miss Arler. Our Miss Wiltshire isn't there. There's nothing we can do to help them. Right. Goodbye, World Sea Guardian. Farewell, Speaker. And so we returned to one floor, and, so and I fell into deep sleep. I should probably die. Are we going to meet the Oracle again? Yep. <laughs> and there's a laughter again. Morning, Miss Isler. Rise and shine. I find myself able to get up from the floor. My body feels heavy. <laughs> My knee's weak. Mom's spaghetti. Hmm, what's wrong? <laughs> Not feeling well. What was your little MacGuffin quest? Shut up. The Oracle extends their hand to me. <laughs> Here, a helping hand. Things might seem a little hard right now, but let's get through it together. I don't take the Oracle's hand. Ah, if you don't accept the help, your condition will worsen, you know. My condition doesn't matter. You're nothing more than a tool, and I'll be the one to decide what to use you. So don't you dare manipulate me. Oh. Can I just say that's, that's such a scary sprite? Like, look at it. Looks so fucking creepy. Like, good job developer for making that. Or artist. Like, holy fuck, look at that shit. <laughs> You're just so afraid of being incapable, aren't you? Because, in truth, our little Miss Scarlet Isler isn't at all, isn't all that smart, is she? Well, I, I, I was hard stuck on that puzzle for like half an hour, maybe. Was that half an hour? Maybe 50 minutes, 20 minutes. I was, I was pretty stuck on that puzzle, to be honest. Or was it? I have no idea how stuck. I was pretty stuck on that puzzle, anyway. Because in truth, only Miss Scarlet Isle is not a smart issue. <gasps> Intelligent, athletic, and all around perfect. Just who in the world is that? Your super ego? You only try to seem proper or organized, but in truth, you struggle with the most basic memory puzzles. So, stop shitting on me, game. So much that you'd rather have your puppeteer solve them for you. Hey man, oh, alright, I'm smart. 20 25 minutes going by chat timestamps. That's that's kind of weak of me. That's weak. That's weak. But that's okay. You don't have to be special, you know. Just remember the way I accept you just the way you are. Thanks, Oracle. I kind of want to take their hand. Hanker isn't here. I should go look for him. What will we be get, get incinerated? I'm pretty sure we'll get incinerated if we do that. Just look now, how many... Okay, we're pretty far away from that save file where we restart everything. Let's see. Let's just save there. Oh, look, that's fucking incinerated. Okay, never mind. We're safe. Can I look at God? I want to look at meat the meat cans or God. Mm. Felix! Hello, konnichiwa! Good morning. Which floor are we going to next? Uh, Mr. Honker? Ah, you were here. You didn't notice me at all. I'm busy. Lots of data analysis to do. Take Florence. Sixth floor. Fine. Not very talkative today, are you? I need time to recharge. What for will do? Felix rummages in his pockets for what appears to be a tiny transmission device. Hello, Florence. 
Can you babysit Miss Isla today? No, no, Enya's fine. You'll get your promotion. <laughs> babysit? Florence arrives a few minutes later. Morning! Talk to me as soon as you're ready to depart, Miss Isla. I'm never ready. Can I look? Can I go through the house? Let's not go there. Fine. You can be my park champ. Come here. I'm the one excluding you today, huh, Miss Isla? Let's go. Attempts at a friendly conversation were completely ignored. Yes. Just with the part with the partner, new journey. Let's go. Anything on the monitor? Oh F. Oh, fuck. Yeah, but last time I couldn't check it. I couldn't check it last time I think. That's since rich, but we can also just do the title. Hmm. Let's just low back. Let's go low back there. It's not really that far to go, you know. Let's just walk. Let's do the walk. Let's see here. Doesn't seem like it. Let's see, skip all this. Brr. Brr. Okay, I can't check it. Shame. Yep. A damn shame. Then we departed on the crusade. Huh. Look, look, my character's looking to the right now. Or to the right, this way. It's, instead of looking forward. Interesting. Kind of weird. Anyway, let's uh, go in through here. And um, what the fuck is this? And here we are. Welcome to Six Flo Floor Laboratories. This place looks quite high tech. Well, of course, this place is built like a big testing polygon. Have you been there before? Yes. Yeah, kinda. Dr. Huxley makes us run all kinds of errands, so they involve other floors too. Dr. Huxley? Henry Huxley. He's Mr. Honecker's uh, uncle. Yeah, that's what we agreed on. Agreed on? What? Anyhow, Dr. Huxley is an amazing man. We all look up to him. Let's get to business, shall we? Uh, let's, uh, let's just save that. It's a human-sized capsule. Human-sized capsule. Welcome to the Sixth Floor Laboratories. In the capsule to initiate the Virtual Vessel program. Explore the laboratories while your body relaxes in the detox capsule. Well, this is new. It wasn't here before. Yeah, I can see there was a reason they were reinforced the security measures, but I can't fathom what, it could, could, what could it be. Honestly, I'm really disappointed. There's no thrill to it if you can't get diced into cubes. Would it be weird of me to say I'm relieved? I don't feel like it's like an anti-oracle thing, maybe. Up ahead, memory. Oh, save? Alright, let's save. It's kind of weird. What is... Okay, okay, let's save. What the fuck is this guy? Let's go. Okay, let's go in there. Nani. Oh, I have to enter a capsule. Are we going to enter this? Of course, do you have any vessels to spare in case this one dies? Well, no. Then, there's your answer. Oh, Ara, let's get into the vessel. Virtual vessel creation successful. Success! So, do I just respawn if I die? Yeah, you respawn, but I wouldn't advise dying, because you'll go back to this very room. Probably. It's kind of... Uh, I can't even check my inventory. Nanny. I guess that makes sense. Our bodies lie inside. Let's kill them. Let's kill them. Let's kill our own bodies. Uh, what's gonna happen? If I if I kill my... If I possess my own body in a different body. And I kill my original body. Does my clone still work? Or does it just die? Then you die in real life. Oh my god, just like Inception. Ah oh, shit. Time for puzzle. Memorize the sequence from left to right. Memorize. Memory puzzle, huh? I don't have time for this. Handle it a little bit. Alright. Alright. Hold up. I'll, I'll memorize it. Hold up. There we go. Memorized. I'm just walking them. Anyway. Enter the right sequence of or self destruct. Uh, self destruct. <laughs> Sorry, I had to. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I can move fast now. Jesus fucking Christ. What the fuck? I could not move this fast earlier. What in the goddamn? Wait, what, is this? what does this say? Up ahead. Co Wait. Coordination room. Speedrun tactics. Hell yeah! I'm speedrunning this shit. End of sequence, or self -start. end sequence, alright. Instructions, act with the switches in the right order. Exit if you want to retry. Alright. 
So first is uh, oh Jesus, this is this one, and upright. Jesus, guys, she moves so fast. Ah, Jesus, look at this. I gotta go fast. Gotta go fast, 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 and happen. I'm moving so fast. What the fuck is this? Wait, <laughs> what the fuck is this? Ah, uh, anyway. Red-haired Sonic, indeed. Knuckles. His na his, her name was Knuckles. Uh, this one. This one. That one. There we go. Find a puzzle I can do. You did a great job. Fuck yeah. Finally, a puzzle made for Espen. Save Florence. Oh shit, is this like the memory tile thingy from Undertale where I'm gonna fucking die and shit? Let's go. Save Florence. Yes? You seem to be rather talent. Why do you work for Felix Honecker? Ah, well, I don't really work for Mr. Honecker. Is this uncle I'm in debt to? He saved me from Uberia, after all. Let's go, Uberia. Is that a company name? Nah, it's a plant. I play with two types of humans, or men and men. In other words, those who are worth something and those who aren't. But I can just say this music. There's like some club music. I'll skip to know later. Oh, dim. Come on, just when I was commenting on the nice music, they're like, no, go to turn to zero. I came to know it later. There really wasn't a difference. I was a test subject for new inventions in the prosthetics, prosthetics department. They cut my own limbs off and kept reattaching new ones over and over. I couldn't move by, move by myself and had to be taken to my room in the wheelchair. They fed me through a tube. Now that I remember it, personal hygiene was also impossible without the help of the assistants. Talk about personal space. Why are you smiling when I tell me this? This is a horrible memory, isn't it? Huh? Ah, uh, I don't really think about it. What's up with that reaction? <laughs> Shouldn't there have been organizations that should have defended your rights as a human? There were many, but they killed more of us than the scientists did. Ah, oh, come, should I try to protect you? We couldn't be used commercially or kept as pets, be it for therapy or sexual purposes. We weren't needed by all men. Does the reality have to be accepted? Besides, you can't just trust an organization that claims euthanasia is to be a, a protective of love. I'm sorry. Is this like PETA? You know, PETA? None of us needs your PETA, Miss Adler. You can ask me anything. So, uh, are all of your limbs artificial? Yeah, that's right. I assembled them myself. Before that, there was a period when I had various alien-looking prosthetics. Then they actually cut all of them off. So I lived as a talking torso for a while. Bennett was in charge of uh, taking care of me back then, but he wasn't really good at it. But I ran not well in the past. So let's proceed. Alright. Walk on blue and yellow only. Only blue and yellow. Alright. Uh. Guess we can. Blue, yellow, blue, blue, yellow, yellow, blue. Mm. Let's see now. Wait. That's the wrong turn. Hold up. No, wait. I think I need to go this way. Wait a minute. Oh, well. Oh, listen. Sexy view colorblind. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Why can't I go on orange? Because it's a mix of blue and. I'm pretty sure blue and. Uh, Oh, blue and yellow is green. Never mind. Wait, can I go on green? Nope. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never fucking mind. Game is like, no, you're not allowed. You're not allowed to mix colors. Mixing colors, bad. Y yeah, but I was thinking like blue and yellow, green. You know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna memorize this all on my own. I'm not, I'm not looking at the picture, by the way. I'm totally doing this all on my own. Totally. Yeah, man. I did a great job. Fuck yeah. Anyway. Here we see. Seems like I need to go this way, then. I don't see any... Wait, I can, I can go this way. Fuck. I didn't notice that. 
<laughs> Fuck. Each person has a drink from the vial, so proceed. The vial on the left contains poison. It's just a simulation, right? Right, but one of us won't be able to proceed past this point. But then how? This might be a trap too. Yeah, they want to separate us, but... It's okay, Miss Sala, I can drink it. Are you sure? Yes, you need to find Miss Walsh don't you? So don't worry about me. Besides, this whole situation smells like a cheap angst prompt. I'm not letting that, that escalate. A drink for the right vial. Oh, I, I, can't even I can't even choose, okay? I'm not drink the vial with the poison. Ugh! Her image becomes the solo. And then there's silence. She's gone. But I need to keep moving forward. Let's go, Lilith. Let's go, Lilith. Let's go. A vial with green liquid inside. Let's drink it. Focus room. Focus room. Oh god. Do not fear warm colors. Okay, so red is good. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is. How the fuck am I supposed to react that? Good luck, have fun. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. I'm just supposed to dodge everything. Like, what the fuck is this bullshit? Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> what the fuck is this? The reaction time we're gonna have, man. Jesus Christ. Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay, dude. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Ooh. Wow, game. Okay. Yep. Congratulations. Wait, why is she here? Wait, save? Sure. Florence, told you. I got back faster than you completed those rooms. How? But how? Let's say I took the secret passage. Anyway, let's get moving. Why did we just not use the secret passage earlier? This one shadow presence is this close. Alright. You know, you know what? Florence is super sus right now. Just sussy. Explore next room. Alright. Ooh. <gasps> Are those mad cats? Wow. What in the world is this? Phew, this place has changed one bit. Have you been here before? Yeah, well, it's been a long story. You can take your time looking for... Wait. Take your time looking around. Okay, okay. This area appears to be in a stasis field. Just look at all these mecats. <gasps> mecats! Finally! Woo! That's what I've been waiting for! That's what it's all about! Woo! Yeah, baby! Whoever's in charge of this place, they probably want to stop the infestation from sp spreading. Wait, what? Mecats? What, the maggot and a cat? A mecat! Ugh, gross. Scarlet, you son of a bitch. Or daughter of a bitch, because... Don't insult the mad cats. They're cute. I want to plush you. Come on. They're lovely. I always want to keep one, but we workers aren't allowed to have pets. There's no way I'm ever keeping one. Do each their own. Let's get to our investigation. Oh shit, what the fuck? I can see something there. Okay. Can I zoom? I see... Oh, I'm... Oh, what the fuck? Was this standing there all this time? What? What the fuck was that camera angle? Anyway, let's... Did you know? Did you know? They make really loud sounds when they communicate. Like, meow! Yeah, no, I'm, I know. I made those noises. Aha, I found something in his pockets. USB stick. Let's look around a bit more. They use it as the console. Burger King mag maggot letters. The last thing you want in your burger in your ma Burger King maggot letters is some of this piss. Documents titled The Oracle Project. The Oracle? The parasite? Do remember that we are on a different floor. Local scientists might have given this name to something else. Amphitheus and Communism. Artificial religion and game theory. <gasps> but that's just a game theory. Thanks for watching. Channels of parallel worlds. Can I look at that note? No. That's just a game theory. Stand back, Miss Aller. We're in a simulation, but still. But I wanna pet the cats. I wanna pet the cat. Did you? Yeah, they make meow. Okay, so only one of them are special, apparently. This music, though. Yeah, man. I want to reach out to pet the mad cat. Hi, little mad cat. Uh, I'd rather not touch them. I'm sure you change your mind if you met a domesticated mad cat. True that. Yeah, but. I still I already know that, though. TV world. A world inside a TV. Oh, I've been there. 
What's a brand new universe develop in real time right before your eyes? Every character is the main character. All of the 50 has story with us, 24-7 every day. Cool. Do they feed them brains? No, no, they aren't zombies, if that's what you want to know. They feed them feelings and emotions. Mainly negative ones to that. Fear is a really strong emotion, for example. Hmm, what's this thing? Not this one. Let's be careful, we're in the simulation with Sil. Flex, we're safe. Okay, let's go here. There's something written on the screen. Can you read it? Hmm, let's see, it says the Oracle Project. Name, Charlotte Wiltshire, unit... Ooh, 91! Like, the other one was Q84, but this is 091. Status, brain activity, green. Vital activity, green. Lung oxygen, green. It's... she's... still alive? Seems like it. So that's why you're feeding it hopelessness and stuff in the first game. Why junk food kills them. Why what? We're feeding it hopelessness. That's why you're feeding it hopelessness and stuff in the first game. They feed it negative emotions. So that's why junk food didn't kill them, because that's positive? But yeah, they feed on negative emotions. Oh, I just realized! But domesticated one lived because it was feeding on my negative thoughts. Is that what you're meaning? Like in, the, in episode 1 and 2? That Maca was feeding off Charlotte's negative thoughts? Holy fucking shit. Seems like it. They're probably keeping her alive for the sake of TV world. It's a universal of mind after all. Yeah, literally mentioned when you check the feed in those games. Yeah, okay, okay. Mm. You're feeding into the stuff. In the first- Oh yeah, in the first game. Okay, okay, I see. They're probably keeping her alive for the sake of TV world. It's a universe of her mind after all. If she were to escape or die, it ruined her show. So they weaken her body and keep her mind on suppressants. Ironically, it's a mag investigation that got these scientists in the end. Like this. What? I didn't hear you. Something like this. It's too cruel. It's the entertainment industry, Miss Aller. You just need to accept it. There's no way I'll accept something like that. It's wrong. Why should it be like this? Man, people from the second floor are so difficult. What should we do? We can't leave her like this. Is that so, then? What, you what do you suggest, Miss Aller? Kill her? No. Then transfer brain into a new vessel. Completely wiping her memory and therefore killing her as a person. No, I... Then the only right answer is, let's go home. But I just want to help. You can't. There's nothing you can do. Let's leave the simulation, Miss Aller. Your Miss Wiltshire isn't there. It's unfair. I'm, f I'm fairly sure she didn't want to end up like this. Why must it be that way? Perhaps that's how it should be. There's no way I'll be at peace with this. Why can't I save anyone? Your Miss Wiltshire is in another castle. Indeed, indeed. This is just like every... Fucking hell, this is Super Mario Brothers all over again. God damn it. With a heavy heart, we shut down. The virtual simulation program and return to our bodies. I return to normal. Let, let's check the on, on Florence. New task, check on Florence. Oh god, don't tell me she's dead. Hey Florence. Florence, wake up! <coughs> Thank god you're awake. You want too much, miss. I'm alright. You don't seem like it, what happened? Oh, well, this capsule was out of the detox spa, right? Looks like the soap effects wore off. Excuse me? Let me explain. We workers have a regular soap intakes as a must. It affects us in a way where we become restless and hyperactive, alarmingly so. Also, it lowers our intellectual abilities and inhibits analytical thinking processes. Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to work 20 hour shifts with such a vigor. Nobody would. Not after what we went through before our life here. You were raised in labs, right? Yeah. Imagine living in a box with no control over your life. The lights go on and off. Sometimes you get food. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes the food's poisoned. On purpose, of course. It was like that for Ben, too. No wonder he wants to forget. Thankfully, they didn't use us for breeding, but... There was a department for that, too. Lector was there. Lector? A co-worker of mine. You don't want to know him. Okay. Most of the workers have severe PTSD. Except the androids. They have it easy. That's why soap is the best thing that happened to us. We can just happily move forward and do errands without thinking too much. I'm trying to keep the dose in check, but Bennett is a total soap junkie. I shouldn't get emotionally involved with these people's problems. Only if I will share my nurse. Can you walk? Yes, yes, not mind me, let's leave. What the fuck? That's kind of fucked up. I offer Florence my shoulder and she leans on me. 
We slowly walked towards the elevator and left the sixth floor behind. Interesting. <laughs> and there is the fucking Oracle thing again. Slept well, Miss Tyler. Oracle. <laughs> We're so bored. Every book read, every story over entertain us. Oracle looks, locks me in a light embrace, leaning their weight on me. <laughs> Get off me. Ah, oh, so cold. I don't have time for this. I have to find Charlotte Wilshire. What will you do when you find her? Killer? No, God's no. Murder. Cold-blooded homicide. Just admit it. She makes your blood boil, doesn't she? Shut it, I'm not in Acker. How are you so sure? Duh, I didn't cause a massacre at the entire school. Oh, really? Maybe it's about time you did? Like I said, shut up. I'm not a murderer. I won't become one. Of course you aren't. After all, everyone in this world is free to make the choices they want. You're provoking me, aren't you? Maybe. Still. Don't ask Sarah and DC. They are fun. Yet you. Truly a killjoy, as they say. Did it, occur to, did it occur to you that in the house, you're the odd one out? I. But since we're here now, you learn to have fun too. I'm not falling for that provocation. Leave me alone, you ugly pest. That hurt. Why are you like this, we wonder? Is it peer pressure? Social stereotypes? Mental illness? Which is it? Or are you actually the only hopeful person in this world? You must be thinking, this place is the lost cause. Nothing is meaningless. We aren't worthless. If everyone will do what I say, we'll crawl out this bottomless pit. I can make everything right if I just try. I can become everyone's savior. Oh, you're about to wake up soon. You're running out of time, aren't you? Oh shit. I wake up in a severe coughing fit. In front of my eyes is a toy rabbit. <gasps> oh my god, is that Felix? Morning. Uncle says that rabbit toys and accessories cheer up the mentally ill pa patients. But it looks like it didn't work. Uh, no. Thank you, I'll cherish it. Come on, rabbit toy, let's go! Looks like your condition is getting worse. In the first game, uh, wasn't the rabbit uh, Felix? Looks like your condition is getting worse. I just need to go to new floor. Yep. Right, you do. I already arranged the trip for you. Oh, the song. The song is kind of nice. I already arranged the trip for you. I still have business to finish here, so... So you'll be going with Bennett. Oh, hell yeah, let's go, Bennett! The TV remote person? Yes, that guy, there he is. Let's go, my gem. Hi, Miss Eiler, hi! Grace, so already, is that your natural color? Ah, uh, yes, it is. Hello, Mr. Bennett. It's nice to meet you. Yay! So, are we going? Are we going right now? And uh, where are we going? You didn't tell them? I both love and hate this day. <laughs> Hell yeah, best day ever. And worst day because I'm dying. But uh, hey, best day ever, we're, we're with Bennett. You didn't tell him? I'm fairly, sure, I'm fairly sure I explained it in great detail. The soap side effects are really something else. Hey, you used to love it too. I was young back then. You must seem young to me. I'll explain it again. You'll be going to explore ninth floor for traces of Charlotte Milchard. Ninth floor is infants for its advanced civilization that turned their floor into a garbage dump. That's why it's called landfill. Yay, garbage! So, are we going? Are we going right now? Yes, let's have a small breakfast and set out, shall we? Hmm, that's a good point. They haven't been eating at all, I think. And so we did. So we're just skipping the breakfast scene after mentioning it. That's kind of weird. Like, you can't mention breakfast scene without showing it. Come on. That's like basic, uh, oh my god, he's so cute, look at him, he's so adorable, for Bennett. Hmm, the doors aren't opening. Try pressing the emergency button? Okay, I press the emergency button, and the floor below us opens. Ah! Which can we use them? Do we just fall to death? Oh, okay, we're here. Ow, 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 that hurt. What? This pile of smelly organic waste stuff in the wall. Thankfully, it wasn't the tech garbage pile next to it. Lucky! Well, time to report to Mr. Honecker. Hey, Mr. Honecker? Mr. Honecker! Mr. Honecker! Is, is that a reference to Metal Gear Solid? Hey, sa Snake? Snake! Snake! You know? You don't need to shout like that. Oh my god, it is! Look, it's the, it's the fucking uh, codec. You don't need to shout like that. I can hear you. Heh <laughs> uh, Colonel. Uh. My ass cheeks. Best game. Yeah. So, did you arrive at the night floor? Yeah, this place stinks. The anomaly is located underground. Find a way to get there. Hey! Oh, 
Wait, I think I'm missing something. What could it be? Ah, what is it? Uh, I think I lost Miss Eiler. Oh, you, you, oh, Charlotte isn't there. What the fuck? <laughs> Look at his color. He lost all the color. Except for his eyes, though. His eye, his, not his, those eyes, but those eyes, you know. Those are still yellow. I think I lost Miss Eiler. What? But no worries, I'll find her in a moment. Oh god, you better. I mentioned the system note. Connection to Scarlet Lost. Attach your control strings to Bennett. With Bennett's old school world view, you'll see the world in new light. Oh god! Oh god, I'm fucking terrified now. How? I swear. I was this is probably just gonna be a super nice. Or it's gonna be a LSD. Or not, never mind. Okay, everything's fine. Never mind. Uh, see his diary? Is that still the same? Yeah, it looks like the same. I'm just skipping. Hmm. Flashlight. I'm sorry. His eyes are red, like Hanukkah's. Hmm, I wonder why. Hmm, hmm. Oh let's go. Garbage them. Let's go. Can we go this way? Nope. Let's go up here. Oh, okay, I found her, but what the fuck happened to her? And what the fuck was. I skipped the dialogue because I was running. Fuck. Uh, Mr. Honecker? Okay, okay, you said uh, Mr. Honecker? Yes, Mr. Bennett. I think Miss Isla broke. What do you mean, broke? Is she alive? No, yes, I, I don't know. I think she hit her head on something when we fell out of the elevator. God damn it, Bennett, you had one job. She's already infected with a parasite, and now there's a head trauma? I should know better than to trust my patients who are so bad at it. Sorry. Uh, fine, just take her to which house whereabouts. She should be down below. So find a way to get there and I'll aid you if anything comes up. Got it, Miss Honecker. Acquired Scarlet Isla. Is she she's later on an item. Small, a bit heavy, still breathing. Alright, she's an item now. Can I use her? For my own selfish uh, pleasure? Experience the greatest of joys. Take the challenge in the center, Eden. Seems fishy. I agree, the center, Eden. Huh, something is off about this. Bad. <laughs> what do you mean bad? Let's go with- oh, oh, do I have to go this- up here? No, what? What the fuck am I supposed to go? Do I just go back? Uh, do we go this way? Hold up. Uh, never mind. Seemed like I was supposed to go somewhere, but I didn't see where. Let me see, hold up, let me go up there again. Go up here. The scent to Eden. Where though? Oh, it's so dark in here. You have a flashlight, would you remember? Oh! I see, I see. Let the challenge begin. Challenge, find the exit. Tip, you can use the items you will obtain in front of various objects. Choose an item from the menu and interact with the object again. Uh, is this an escape room kind of thing? I'm never good at those. Deal with it. Oh, we don't have all day, so I'll help you if you fail to use your brains. Uh, cook and ball torture the first time. Waiting for you to cruise through this one. Probably not. If you feel like a challenge is too difficult or illogical, you can ask Mr. Honecker for help. Just use Honeckerpedia from your items menu. He might not solve the puzzle for you, and sometimes he won't reply, but it'll provide useful hints when the time is right, probably. Alright. I'll be back, okay? Alright, did I just drop him? It's a fuse box that I can use. Then you say, oh, there I get items here. One soda costs five coins and I'm broke. Can I steal from her? She's not dead, right? Really, I, I can't steal? Or can I use uh, the book or this to crush it, no? Hmm. Room 431. Locked. 431. Locked. Oh, let's go. There are some coins in this piggy bank. Take those. Yes. I got five coins. How convenient. I can buy myself a soda with this. Or should I? I want an axe. Nice! Let's probably just use the axe in the machine. The post with the girl with a halo. Descend with me, it says. The laptop is plugged in. Double draw is locked. But I should just break it. Hey, don't damage private property. I'm gonna do it anyway. Hey, don't just swing it around. I'm bored. There's no one to hit it with. <laughs> He's a fucking psychopath. <laughs> hmm, there's no power. Shouldn't there be a fuse pocket or something? I'll look for it. I will, I will. First, let's go in here. It's 
probably explore every inch. The water dripping from the tap smells like waste. Cross empty. Some jars on the shelves, but they're empty too. So this is rotting inside the trash bin. So old fridge. Fridge is plugged in. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's anything here. This music though. Pretty hardcore. Can I even just use the uh, axe here? Hey, don't just swing it. Okay, no moment. I have to use the coin, apparently. Okay, I can. I quite saw the can. Let's go. Uh, made from 100% colorful apple juice. Tastes like real watermelon. So just drink it. Oh, there's something solid inside the solar can. But I can't get it out. Uh, exit? Hey, don't just. Hmm. I just need to turn the right, right switch on. Turn on. Ball to the tree, wasn't it? I think it was for the tree, right? Yep. It's all fresh. Oh, wait, wait. Wasn't something here? Was it here? Hanik, Hanik, I got the left to work. I don't want to see validation from. Good job. Uh, uh, it's password locked. I figured as much. Just don't type in, it, in anything, okay? Uh, fine. It's password locked. Okay, that's... Hmm. It's possible to go with the halo, the, the cell with me it says, okay. Hmm. Let's see, and now you're stuck if you're anything like me. Okay, okay, hold up. Let's see. Smell like waste, try something. No fridge. Hmm. Should I, like... It said, it said there was something inside there, right? There's something solid inside the solar camp, but I can't get out. My god. I can't get out. Okay, go in here. It's locked. It's locked. Just you know. Turn off? No. She's not dead, right? Let me see. Can I use the solar can? Hmm. X. <laughs> I'm swinging it at her, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, hold up, let me see. Oh, this is empty though. I'm gonna swing the axe at everything. You know, that, that's usually what I do in games when I'm bored. Just swing it at everything. I use the axe on her. Hmm. There shouldn't, shouldn't there be something to open solar cans with somewhere? Water dripping from the tap smells like waste. Also empty. Just on the shelf, empty. Why can't you use the... Let me see. I can use the... So I can here. Hmm. I'm going inside the trash bin. Can I seriously not use the so I can... I can only use... Let's try this. Wait, what? Let's try this. What are you doing? Put your soda into the freezer. Ah, I see. Did you, do you just want cold drinks or do you actually know what you're doing? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> do you just want cold drinks or do you actually know what you're doing? Both! But it sets the power to maximum and waits for a while. Jesus Christ! Oh! Soda murder successful! And here's the item that was inside! How long did it wait? Oh wait, it did put on maximum though. I caught a key. Did the key not break? How is the key okay? What the fuck? Uh, there's a key work on... A small key work on the open. Let's open it What could this key open? It's locked. Okay, not that, not that one. I'm assuming it's none of these. Or maybe, maybe this. What could this key open? Maybe it was a drawer. Wasn't the drawer locked? Let me see. Let's open this lock with the key I found. Oh, USB stick. Let's go. Just don't type anything. Hold up. Obviously, let's go and secret inside. Yep. Here I go. I should just boot the PC from the USB stick, shouldn't I? Actually, yes, just restart it and set the boot prior to settings BIOS. I know, I know. Ah, there's something on the screen. Hmm, it's a clue. Do you know what it is? It must be a treasure map. Let me redraw it. Acquired a treasure map. There's something here. It must be here. Faster to break the floorboards with. I can use my hands, though. Don't, it's all very painful for you to touch things, isn't it? Uh, I'll just use the axe. Here I come! <laughs> I can 
Psychopath. Lass mich her. Oh, das ist Corpse das hinten nach. Das ist ein Secret Passage. Hey, don't forget Miss Eiloch. Oh, you're right. What the fuck? Let's go! Let's go! Just save. Let's fucking go. Oh, das ist Corpse hinten nach. Das ist Secret Passage. Let's go, human, human maggots. So rude. How's he going? Alright, oh, so that puzzle was way too easy, right? Let's fix that. Let's fix that. So what do you mean by that? How's it going? We're well, some kind of te a testing facility, I guess. This is the first time we've seen a room like this. Oh, Miss Eiloch. Still not dead. Alright, keep going. Rotting God's Corpse Tree. At least she's breathing, indeed. Do your homework, sister notes. Alright, I'll do my homework. Looks like I need to type in something and press OK. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Oh, well. How do I leave this? Nani? How do I leave this page? How do I just, uh. What the fuck am I supposed to. How do I just type. There. No good. Okay, never mind. BRB, this seems like a good time. Alright. You'll be back. They always come back. Hotting God's Corpse Tree. Read. Tiny white book. Uh, Miss Anakin, what's this book about? It's about Morse code. Morse. Breaking the barrier. It's a method of transmitting information in clicks, on, off tones or lights. Or series of dots and dashes in a written form. For example, an SOS signal will look like three dots followed by three dashes and ending with another set of three dots. SOS, I see. Change the book for a Morse chart. It should have one. Oh, you're right. Here it is. Thank you. I'll just uh, take a picture of that. Oops, fucking hell. There we go. Now we got the Morse code thingy. Is there only a chart of numbers? Yeah, some pages will turn out. Big grey book. Uh, Mr. Hanek, I can't read that well. It's a book about the Caesar uh, cipher. Wait. There we go. It's a book about the Caesar cipher. Mathematics of secrets. It's a kind of cipher that uses a substitution system to encrypt the messages. For example, ROT2 replaces a letter with the letter after two letters in. Well, replace the letter with the letter after two letters in the alphabet. Okay, so instead of A, it skips uh, two letters afterwards, so either C or D. Let's see. Place a letter with the letter after two letters in the alphabet. A will become C, B becomes D, and so on. Okay, okay, I see. Oh, I think I get it. So soap will become UQCR in ROT2. Alright, exactly. Medium self right book. Miss Annika, what is this book? It's a book about sign language. Signing made it easy. You know what it is? A language that uses manual communication to convey meaning. As expected of Honikopedia. There's a pamphlet in alphabet in it. A quite sign language alphabet. Alright, let's look at it. A, B, C, D, F, G. Oh, let's take a picture of this too. Might be useful. There we go. There we go. Oh, fucking hell. So many. Holy fucking shit. Okay, let's take another photo. There we go. Ah, fucking hell. So many. Holy fucking shit. Guess I gotta get everything. There we go. Uh, Alright, I think I've got everything now. Let's see. There's nothing inside the desk. Something inside the desk. Not there. Hmm? There's a note in this desk. This might be useful. Acquire a hint. Let's go. Hint. Hmm. Let's see now. Which one is this? Looks like a schizor somewhere. Let me see a schizor. Is that a V? Okay, V. Okay, okay. V and then V1. V19. Is that it? V19. Oh, my Sonic opened. So it was V19 after all. Well done. <laughs> I'm so smart indeed. Now let's see what's inside. Huh? What did you find? 
It's some kind of journal. So boring. I thought it would be some severed head or something. It might contain an important hint. Make sure to flip through it. A school diary. Okay, let's uh, look through the school diary. Where did homework and nervous with signatures? Hmm. Aha, there's something written in red. Homework. Find exit. Well, that's what, this wasn't really helpful. It might be a hint or a code. So get to code decoding. Should you be helping? Your brains will turn into liquid soap if you don't try thinking once in a while. You're a bully. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I fucking love those sprites. Just look if there's something inside the desk. There might be another hint somewhere. Or not, you know. What's this? Hmm. Is there something else? Nothing inside there. Do your homework, says the note. Is this a movie? Parting Gold Scor Corpse 3. Hmm. Look in red. Homework. Find the exit. Find exit. This is a book. It's a book of a sign language. Hmm. Hmm. Let's try this. Oh. Okay, let me, let me just see now. Let me see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, 9. I'm looking at that. Hmm. Find the exit. Okay, I'm gonna assume it's like skipping three letters, you know? So, let me just, let me just write down on the notepad. Let me see. Notepad, let me see. Let me see. Yeah, I'm finding it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm solving it. Hold up. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah. H. Okay, I think I have it now. Hold up. Okay, let's see here. Okay, no. Let's see now. Hold up. Oh, oh wait, was it not? Oh no, 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 wait. Let's see. Let's get out. Okay, okay. How do I? Okay, there we go. Okay, so. Ah, uh, uh, yes. I just wrote that so I could get out. Sh chill, chill. I, I, I did not like. I just wrote that so I could get out the menu because I didn't know how many letters I needed. Reasonable answer, indeed. That's, that's my brain. Sometimes. On, on, on one of the puzzles. Not this one, though. We already solved it. Just wait and see. Uh, <laughs> wait to... Make a little skip. There we go. And then... This one. Okay, we... I'm this. No, what? Was it not that? Hmm. Okay, that's confusing. Hmm. Because I thought find the exit. Oh, let me see. Isn't that it? Let me see. Find... Oh, let me see. I. What's the I? Okay, so that's K. P, what's it supposed to be? Do this. Find... X... And then C. Let me see. X, right. Isn't yours ROT2? Uh, yeah, I was thinking this was... Yeah, yeah I was doing ROT2, you know. Or did it continue from that V... V19, was it? V19 was continuing from that. I don't think it was. Let me see. Because it wasn't red. Find the exit. And that was supposed to be a clue, it seemed. Okay, let me see. Exit. And then, T. Or is it going to be... Go back? Let me just see now. M maybe it's reversed. 
I have to actually do the opposite. You want? You want? Maybe it's the opposite. Just for that. So, example, F. Instead of F, it's supposed to be D. And then, so I, it's G. And then instead of D, it's L. And then instead of D, it's B. And then I assume uh, space. And then E. X. I. And then T. Oh, okay, no mind. Because this. Let me see. That'd be ROT24. What? I don't fucking know. They, they mentioned ROT2 uh, Harry, man. Like. It, it, I think it was. Big grey book. Simple. So, ROT2 replaces a letter with a letter after two letters in alphabet. A becomes C, B becomes D, and so on. Hmm. I don't think Rotten Corps, Gals Corps 3 has anything to do with it. So I'm not talking about. Do your homework, says the note. Because the book. Let's see him. School Diary. Hmm. Uh, something written in red. Find the exit. Hmm. Find the exit. Because that's exactly not letters though. Or is it just or is it just write find the exit? Let, 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 let's just write find the exit. Fuck it. No, oh, okay, never mind. Maybe it's without the. Ah, oh, that's not really making sense. Hmm. We just write that. I, I need to get out of the menu. No, fuck! I, I just want to get out of the menu. There we go. Let me see. Sign language alphabet. British version. Ugh! His eyes are red like Hanukkah's. Hmm. It's just breathing. Do your homework. It says do your homework and this says homework. Find the exit. Hmm. I like how you're just ignoring the biggest clue. What's the biggest clue though? Is there a clue inside the menu? What do you mean by checking out? Wait, let me see. Well, this is something he said. Something written in red. Find the exit. Like, I'm assuming find the exit is... Like, it says, do your homework. Homework, find the exit. Oh, I'm not gonna spoil it. Fine. So get to decoding. It might be a code, so you need to decode it, but... What do I have to write in... No, I, I, I don't find it in Morse, though. Like, uh, and I can't really, wait, 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 was the sign language in the, uh, I'm just going to assume there wasn't sign language there, right? Let me see. In the, if we change, turn the page. I, oh, nope. Okay, no, no sign language there. No, fucking hell. Keep entering the menu again, by accident. Because the, they're saying it's a code and I need to decode it. You know? Might be a hint or a code, so you get to decoding. Yeah, so I'm gonna reverse it, you know. But let me see. Find exit. Let me see. Uh... I'll just write it all, all. Mm, but the... <sighs> fucking hell, it's like supposed to be a space there, right? Uh, let's just uh, do I just not give a shit factor there's a space there. I'll probably just find there's a space, yes. Can't spoil that much. Okay, okay, there is there is a space. I've tried both ways, you know. I've tried 
encoding it and decoding it. I, I tried both ways. So it's kind of weird because I did. So get to decoding. Like it's well, and it was all in caps lock. Like if it jumped up and down from uh, caps lock to no caps, cap to no cap, then I would be like, ah, that makes sense. But now I'm kind of. Mm. Uh, it's all caps, space middle. What the fuck was that? Okay, it suddenly just popped up, but. But yeah. Like. What an exit, but. I, the, the problem is. Okay, hint of course, I get the decoding. We don't try to think once in a while. You're a bully! Like, uh, let, let me just. Uh, wh wh where's the. Where's the note thingy? Oh, uh, like. I do have an alphabet here, but it's it's this one. But I, I can't write in uh, fucking sign language. So that's a no-no. And I just solved the puzzle with that. And it didn't give me anything for Morse codes, except for numbers. It just says, find exit. Hmm. But, okay, you said uh, to that, ignoring the biggest clue. What's that? Isn't that the fact? Is, isn't... Oh, it's written red. Let me think now. Does, red, does the color red have something to do with this? It's not an inventory item. Okay. It's not an inventory item. What? There's nothing inside the desk. It's not... An well, is there something on the floor that I haven't seen yet? I don't really see anything that's... kind of worth can interact with. Like, I'm already... It's not that small. What? Like, I've already read all the books, if that's what you're... you're uh, talking about. Do your homework, says the note. Do your homework. Homework. Oh, is that the clue? Homework. Cycle homework. Nothing says save. But it's supposed to have a space between it. What's the space here for some reason? Homework. No, it's one word. I'm not supposed to check my items, but. Isn't that clue supposed to help me with this? Okay, I checked the. I think I was cops three. Hmm. I have already checked all the desks. I have checked her. How can I interact with her if I use uh, flashlight on her? You were so close. But you were so close. When? When? Am I close now? Like 30 seconds ago. Is this in, is the clue in the middle of the room? On the right, left, bottom, up? Like, where, where is this object you're talking about? Oh, fucking hell. Uh, it's in near the middle, yes. What the fuck? Where? Where though? Whoa. Like, I've, all, I've already used the safe. If that, if the, if the, are you talking about the safe? Like... I've already, I already used the safe though. Close with no cigar. Close with no cigar. Rotting God Scorps 3. Or is that the clue? Rotting... Rotting God Scorps 3. Is that the clue? But wait, that doesn't make any sense because that's more than... Alright, let me see. God Scorps. Rotting God Scorps 3. Hmm. God's corpse, maybe? But I don't feel like that makes any sense. Or is it rotting god? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, no. Burning heart. Burning heart. How? Burning heart. Like, is that a clue? Is that the biggest clue? Rotting. Oh, wait. Heart is. What's the. What's the little. 
There's a little line dash under heart. How? There you go. But how? how? I'm still confused. How is that? How is that a clue, though? Cutting God's Corpse 3. Like, it's not a 9 letter thing or 9. I'm confused. Rot. Or is it just Rot? Maybe it's just. Uh... Oh, it's, I, fucking, I don't fucking know. Or is it just Rot? Is it just Rot? No? Okay, maybe. But wait, no, no, it had a, it had a space in the middle, right? Do your homework, find exit. Oh, ah, there you go. Yep, okay. Hmm. Like, the only thing I can think of is God's corpse, or God corpse, but... God corpse, but that... I feel like that doesn't make any sense. That little underline matters. Really? That matters? Rot matters. Was it because you do something with it? Let me see. Let me just see now. Rot. Let me see now. Rot. It's a rot. Rot. No, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, that doesn't make any sense either. Mm, stop. See. That little underland matters. Hot thing. Thing God. I believe it. <gasps> Don't believe it, man. Like, holy fucking shit. What the fuck are these puzzles, man? But does it have something to do with the. Uh, does the puzzle have anything to do with the. Uh, with uh, R-O-T-2. Does this have anything to do with that? R-O-T-2. Does it have anything to do with that? Like, come on, it, it should have something to do with that, right? You can figure that one out. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Stop it leaving me, man. <laughs> I'm so damn mad. <sighs> Rotting God's Corpse 3. Rotting God's Corpse 3. Oh, look, it's my favorite letter. Ah. Ah, that's how I feel now. Ah. That's how I pronounce that, by the way, since I'm Norwegian, you know. Ah. Anyway. Do I need that other page? Is there any point in this page here? This IO. Is there any point in that? At all. Or is this the only thing I need? You don't need that, no. Uh, but why did you confuse me about like that then? Rotting corpse. Hold up, let me see. I'm just... Get out of here. That underline matters. A rot. Uh, rotting. I don't want any help from that psychopath though. There's nothing inside the safe now. Hmm. Oh, rotting. Rotting. Three. Rotting. One, two, three. What's the... What's the rotting three? Let me see, rotting three. Let me see, hold up. I think that's... Hold up, I just read. I think I read. Let me see, hold up, let me see. What's that way? Oh. Dang. No, fuck! Rotting. No, oh, okay, never mind. We want to check the cy cypher explanation again. Cypher explanation? What do you mean? Speak about these uh, metal of secrets, the kind of stuff that uses substitution to get encrypted messages. For example, I want to replace the letter with a letter after two letters in the alphabet. A becomes C, B becomes D, and so on. I think I get it. So SOAP will become UQCR in 
ROT2. Exactly. Oh, so, uh, fuck, I... Fuck. I need to... ROT2, eh? Okay, so... I think I was... on something? Let me see. So, I need to encrypt the first part, I guess. ROT, let me see. R... O... T, and then... But... Thing... No, okay. No, okay, chat no longer believes in you. What? What do you mean no? What do you mean no? What do you mean by that? Should I just check what it is? Should I just uh, listen to Hanukkah? Like, I, you got a thing earlier, right? What do you mean by I got... I got a thing earlier. What do you mean? The school diary? It's not written in it, right? Hanukkah, find the exit. I'm confused, man. I'm so dark. Mm. Find exit RO3. Get those scare spinning. Okay, okay, I get it now. I get it. Find exit. So I need to code it. Okay, I get it. So that's RO3. Rot 3. And, I, like, I'm sorry, man. I didn't know there was a. I didn't know there was a thing that was called RO T1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, okay? I, I have never heard about these things before, okay? I'm sorry. I, I, I think I was stuck. I, I I thought there was only one thing that was called ROT2, okay? I'm sorry. It explains it. It explains it, though. Where? Here? Let me just read that again. For example, RO T2 replaces the level to the level. Was it two levels now? But maybe we can see the thing. Is that? Let me see. Oh, fucking up. Press the one button. Let us say this shifts by two letters and gives examples. Yeah, but... I, I'm stuck... Like, I was stuck on the fact that... I thought I had to use ROT2, not ROT3. Alright, find exit. Find exit. Go to the decoder. Alright, find exit. So... Find this. One, two, three. And I is one, two, three. And then, one, two, three. And then this one two three. Then a space. You're doing ROT twenty three now. How? No, I'm not. How am I doing ROT twenty three now? What the fuck are you talking about? Shifting forward twenty three. Shut the fuck up. No, I'm not. What the fuck? Are you... Three equals shift four. Shift forward, but yeah, but I'm decoding it. I'm de didn't say decode. Didn't say to decode it. Didn't say tell me to decode find. Just I'm I'm not decoding it. Oh, uh, fine. Okay, I'm okay, fine. I'm, I'm just gonna do what you tell me. Okay, did it? Yeah, like he's, it told me to decode the message. What the fuck was that? Like yeah, uh, let's see. Like look. So get to decoding. Get to decode. Don't you mean to decode me? You're bully. By the way, sorry for saying shut up, by the way. Oh, shut the fuck up, you know. I, I don't mean it. I, I, it's more like in a playful way. Ho hope you didn't take that personal. I'm sorry, by the way. <laughs> Ambiguous, in indeed. Anyway. Uh, let, let's do it your way. Yeah, I know. Haha. <laughs> I just thought that you be mad at me. Oh, wait, let me see. Find X. Just, that doesn't make any sense, though, because... One. Two. Or is it A, then? Because you, because exit, you know, the letter X. If you move that three three points that way, it becomes one, two, and then three. It rolls over. Oh, it rolls over. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Okay, let's. I'll, I'll, I'll do it your way. Let me see. One, two, three. One, two. Wait. Fucking one, two, three. Then. One, two, three. And the. One, two, three. Uh, let's see. That's why you're going down by three characters at ROT23, since you're moving 23 space ahead to roll back to there. I see, I see. Uh, let me see. I guess so. But I was thinking I was thinking that find the exit was the code. But I had to decode it back to what the answer was, right? If that makes sense. I was thinking, like, find the exit was the encoded word for the code. Yeah, that is poor writing in the game's fault, I guess. 
But uh, let me see, uh, find exit. One, two, three. X, X. One, two, three. And X, C. One, two. Oh, wait, one, two, three. And then T. One, two, three. Hell yeah! I did it all on my own! Hell yeah, I'm so smart! Let's go, it opened! See? You can do it if you try! <laughs> now I have to make, uh, take Miss Isla along. I think I'm forgetting something. Nah, man. I, I think I'm, I'm, I'm not forgetting anything. Yeah, thanks for help, by the way. I, <laughs> I fucking suck ass on this. There we go. I, 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 and this is the part I got stuck on. Oh, the next part? Let's go, Miss Alor. Challenge. Stay alive. You have 30 minutes to prepare. Wow, it's like we're in a B-movie setting. Stay alive? What could possibly kill you in this place? Haha, <laughs> let's find out. Oh, wait, no. You already did that bit. One of the desks annoying. <laughs> We've been there for a while, but she's still out of it. Oh, I think she has a fever. Oh, God. Where's flash with chemicals down on the table? Where's flash with chemicals down on the table? Oh, a knife! I got a knife. Fuck yeah. Now, this is creepy. Well, I will just detonate something by the time... Wait, just detonate something by the time this thing arrives. But, but, what if it's a monster? You are a monster, Bennett. Now, go blow things up. Okay. He looks so personally hurt there. Hmm, what should I make? Aha! Okay, here goes. Do it yourself, bomb. Uh, metal container. KCE plus sugar. Uh, what the fuck did you say? Coke? EC paper, flash, H2SO4. This should be easy enough to make. Cork? I don't fucking know. Okay, I got a bomb recipe. I won't need this. A crush sugar, bottle, cool. T tea time supplies and wine bottles. Check the inside of this corpse, just in case. I was just mean. I was just going to. Okay, I got a clue. There's something written on it. Square plus triangle equals. Okay, cool. Oh, there's something on the floor. Interesting. Wait. Blue. Well, it's the same thing. What? That's kind of weird. What? The, the corpse reminds me of Florence. Oh god. <laughs> Just because she had no hands and legs. What the fuck is this? A red place to hide. There's a keypad in it. Choose OK if you want to go and X if you want to cancel. Okay. Exit. Casual observation. Hmm. Oh, there's a piece of paper in here. I got a blooded piece of paper. Okay, let's look at the piece of paper. 242. Okay, let me see. 242. 15. 9. 31. 10. 1. Oh, I know the answer. Wait, you do? You just have to think in triangles. I just hope you're thinking in right triangles. Let me see. Is that blue? Blue square equal. Plus. Triangle e oh, let me see. Should be thinking three times. Anyway, the right triangle must be co covering a missing number. Yeah, I know. Yeah, let's see, let's see if there's something else. The temperature in the room is low enough to keep these from decomposing. Ah! Oh, something on the limbs! A piece of paper, okay. Another piece of paper. Hmm. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. Uh, and then there's an alphabet there, for some reason. Okay, I'll, I'll take a picture, just in case. You know, just in case, just in case, you never know. You never know, you might need this. There we go, okay, let me see. What's this? A piece of paper with numbers and letters on it. I know that much, what did it mean? It's common knowledge. Like, the first letters of the days in the week, for example. Figure it out yourself. First, wait. What did it just say? Hold up, I gotta read that again. Like, my, my brain... Piece of paper, numbers, letters, I know that much, what they mean. It's common knowledge. Okay, okay, so it's January, February, March, April, Le May. Okay, okay, it's, it's all the months. Okay, okay, it's all the months of the day, of, of the year. The first letter of the days in the week, for example. Figure it out yourself. Okay, okay, I see. I see, I see. Well, so who didn't design these puzzles? That's because it's a multi-purpose product, Miss Arnaker. So we can, let's go. Some empty flask, salt, acid, formula. Hmm, I'll need this. Empty flask. Wait! I, 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 I misclicked. I don't really need this. And. Other chloric acid. 
Yeah, yeah. Let's see, let's see. Let's see this will do. Potassium hydroxide. Potassium. Sulfuric acid. So I'm left in this. Okay, I think I have. He's coming. Wait, why was I not supposed to use the bomb? What do I do it if he's. <laughs> he's coming, so that's so ominous. Uh, there's a small open container to pour HS. H2SO4 into. Combine this with it. Flask? Yes! Okay. I was supposed to put in there, uh, that right. Metal container. Oh, never mind. I messed up. I'm pretty sure I messed up. I was supposed to put in solar can because. Oh, wait. Or maybe not. I don't know. Actually, I don't need a whole ball. Just a cork. Okay. That's good to me. Well, alright, alright. Yeah, I'm not sure if I can do anything else with these things. I need KCI to mix with sugar. Come on, it's that? No, this won't do. Okay, never mind. I don't fucking know, man. Let me see. Okay, core KCI plus sugar. It's music though. Wait. HC1. Yes! It doesn't blow up. And H2 too, but we don't need that. But I need to mix KC1 with sugar. Come on, KC1 with sugar. Yes, got it! Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Wait. KC1 with sugar. Can I use it on myself? What? What the fuck? It's all the same, right? Sometimes if I just use it on myself, KC1 with sugar. No, I can't. Okay, I can't. No, man. I'll use it. Now let's come on all the greens we gathered. Soda bomb, ready for action! It's time to hide! Wait. Was I supposed to hide here? She's okay with my card. Am I supposed to hide there? Hmm. Let me just look at the clues. Triangle. Hmm. Hmm. Nine. Eleven. Fifteen. Hmm. Hmm. Generally thinking triangles. I hope you're thinking right triangles. And the right triangle must be covering a missing number. No, oh, fucking, yeah, I'll press the. Fuck off. The boo. Checks everything one last time. Equals. Hmm. Interesting indeed. But I think I'm supposed to. I think I'm supposed to see a pattern here, right? Let me see. Hmm. Two, four, fifteen, twelve, six. Hmm. I would guess it will be twelve then. You know? I feel like that makes sense. But wait, no, it doesn't because of the one at the bottom. What does it though? Let's see. Let's see. 2, 4, 15, 31. So it's actually 2, 11, 11. Oh, wait, let me see. 6, I guess. I think it's 12. I'm gonna guess it's 12. Let me see. Then it was. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, I see how it's working. I kind of just guessed it last time. Wrong thought. Same answer. Yeah. I see, I see. Let me see. Oh, fucking hell. What's the wrong one? Uh, I was thinking. Interesting. Let me see. Because here it is 10. So, OD? That, I, can, I can't write that, fuck. Wait, how many letters can I write? 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, I can write 6. So, but 10 plus 12, so... 1, 2, 
Mm. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I press the one button. One, two. Hmm, no, no, meant. Wait, what was the toad clue again? I think I think it's... I think it's weird that the fact that the clue I'm on me is the same as the paper on the, on the floor, you know? Interesting. Indeed, indeed. Hmm. Right. The, the, the blue square is 10. Not that much. But what does that have anything to do with the months? I'm kind of confused. And then it's this one. Hmm. Supposed to be a pattern now, right? From the two. Or two. What's that thing? Let me see. No. Nine, eleven, fifty. Hmm. Oh, they just white. Oh, they just white it. Let me see. Hold up. Because it was. Okay, let me see. 10, 12. Let me see. Hold up. 10, 12, 22. No, okay, never mind. Did I have a 30 minutes on me? Let's. Oh, Jesus! It's an event. Did I just steal her? Where was I? Tea time. Okay, hmm. You'll want two numbers there. Okay, only two numbers, really? Really? Only two numbers? Okay. Yep, okay. Uh, wait, let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Let me just look at the, this piece of paper again. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, is this something? Wait, what? Let me see, let me see. I'm gonna look at, uh, if, if I write it down. Maybe uh, it has something to do with the month. Let me see. F. One, two. A, F. Oh, no, 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 it doesn't. Because uh, it goes past 15. Or maybe it's got something to do with. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. F. A, F. Hmm. This is kind of a creative one. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I think I need to write it down. Just, just so I have all the months, you know. Let me see. I'm, I'm gonna write it down. Okay, I've got a notes pad. Let me see. Okay, so uh, February, and then April, February again. Fifteen. Uh, that's March. Blank. The ninth month, that's September. 26, that's uh, December. 21, that's the ninth, so again, it's an S. Then the 10 is October. And then a 1, which is January. What the fuck? And I'm supposed to figure out the middle. Oh, wait, let me see. F A F. Hmm. Hmm. 
Because the first one, this is February. Then this one is April, February. Well, let me see. Does all this stat have anything to do with it? Does the blue square have anything to do with this? Probably not. I probably have to figure this one out by just uh, knowing the... Just knowing the... Uh, months. The fact that these are months, you know? Hmm... Let's see. F, this is this F, F, and A, F. This one is March. This one is September. This one is December, September. Or December, was it? December, September, October, January. So, what's the last one? You're going interesting places with this one. Am I going wrong way or uh, right way? I'm, I'm probably going the right. But didn't you say, yep, this is kind of a great one? Like, did, didn't you mean that I was going the right way with uh, the months? This has something to do with months. Are we going, or am I going completely wrong way when it comes to this? Are you sure you want to know? Yeah, just tell me. A am I on the right track or am I on the wrong track? Does these numbers have anything to do with months? Just tell me. I don't want to be stuck here too long. Like, I got work to do. It's just math. It's just math. How? Uh, let me see. It's just math. Let me see. Two, four. Thinking triangles. Let me see. Let me see. Thinking triangles. Let me see now. How am I supposed to take in triangles, though? I am confused, man. Or is it 15 plus 2 plus 9? So it's like... 26. I don't feel like that makes any sense, though. Like, how, how can that number 26? That doesn't make any sense. Like, because all the numbers on the, all the way to the right are the lowest one. The, all the way to the left is all the highest ones on each line, you know. So this number here should be with either 10, 11, 12, 13, or 14. But 14 doesn't make any sense, though. Mm. Well, let me see. Uh... I don't feel like 11 makes any sense either. I thought 12 did, but... What the fuck, man? But thinking triangles, what the fuck does that mean? Let me see. What a spoiler hint, sure. Whatever. Shoot away, shoot away. I fucking suck at puzzles. Especially when they are this... These kinds of puzzles. Like, holy fucking shit. Yeah, sure. Just give me a spoiler hint. Go on. Combine two numbers to make a third. Yeah, I've been thinking about combining numbers, but I don't feel like it makes any sense. Like, I was thinking these two to make four, you know. But these two to make eleven, that doesn't make any sense, I feel like. Just two. Just two. What do you mean by just two? Come on. Doesn't it? Let me see. Nine plus... Oh, so that become 10. And then it says 11. That becomes 20. It's... Okay, I can see it now. But... What the fuck? That's such a dumb puzzle. So, sorry. Okay, okay, so these two become 4. These two become 11. These two become 10. And since this is 11, 21, 15, 36. It all checks out. Alright. Uh, yeah, it makes sense, but... He said think in triangles, and I, s I started to think like this, like 15, 2, and 9, you know? Like triangle like this. Not this way. Fucking hell. I, I was thinking a bigger triangle. <laughs> You're talking really big triangles. Yeah, exactly. But I won't say this This is even a <sighs> Fucking hell, alright. You are fucking 11. Uh, 10 plus 11, 21. There we go. Great, I unlocked it! Fucking hell. Aside! 
Five triangles. Fil Felix says it. Yeah, no. Yeah, this is tough. Im think, think about it. I'm dumb more than Fe not, not Felix, but I'm, I'm dumb more than Bennett. Imagine. Sometime passes. Three, two, one. Cool. I wonder who it was. All you need is some soap. I'm gonna get some soap after this stream. It doesn't matter now. Yep, at least the door's open. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Oh. Oh my god, I got an achievement. I can handle it, Mr. Honecker. Probably because I solved all the puzzles without his help, right? Please stop bumping into the elevator door like that. The button you need to press is right there. I'm gonna bump a smudge that. I'm gonna bump a smudge that. Okay. A little bit Eden. Sweet! Looks like I can only go down. Have a happy descent then. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Wee. Oh, Miss Alice's face is turning in green. Try to drop her along the way. Will do. Bennett? Yes? I don't have much time left either, do I? You knew? I'm not that dumb. <gasps> no! Not Felix. Maybe this is why I agreed to help Miss Alice in the first place. That's right, Mr. Honnick is so smart. We have figured it out a long time ago. Switching pieces, BRB. Alright. See ya. In like a minute or two. That almost not looked like a whole bunch of idiots to you, right? Right? Enough. You don't need to apologize. Just promise me you'll be you'll make sure she gets to the 11th, 11th floor, okay? Who knows? Maybe there's heaven up there. I promise. Let's go. Bend it. Well then, time to descend. Where the fuck are we? Is this another Charlotte? What the fuck is wrong with this Charlotte? Holy fuck, she's just gigantic. Bennett, report back immediately. The life phone detection devices are going crazy. Bennett, reporting back. We found her. But she's huge. What do you mean huge? Oh. You see anyone else around? No, why? Strange. But devices detect thousands of heat sources in this place. But where could they be coming from? Maybe from inside of her? Are you saying that all the living organisms on this floor reside inside of her body? That is not impossible. But why? Maybe this world was dying, she became a shelter for them. That's what her Eden is. You sound surprisingly smart sometimes, although it must be simply because the soap effects are wearing off. So, considering this floor is just a one big dumpster on the surface, she sacrificed herself so that this floor's inhabitants will survive? That's something I could never imagine Charlotte would say of our floor even do ever doing. Just look at her. She's smiling in her sleep. And it's not the crooked smile that our floors will say always had. <laughs> so true. Too bad, Miss Eller. Your will try isn't her. Sad. This place again. <laughs> Morning, Miss Eller. How are we holding up? Want to give you a sh soothing message? Oh, this is a mas massage. This is a massage. Oh, massage. Okay, it says massage. It's because of you that I'm dying, you know? <laughs> uh, I have no en energy for this. I'm tired, Oracle. I just want to find Wolf and get it over with. <laughs> we know, we know. Oracle comes close and gently takes my hairband off. <laughs> it's okay. You'll find her for sure. You're pretty sure she wants you to. So you can let your hair down for now. By the way, didn't you have fun with Lilith, Mr. Honnick and others? No, just swore for a mission, Scarlet Powdered. Very funny. It wasn't fun at all. But... I learned that this world is bigger than uh, I could have ever imagined. There are a lot of things about it that I don't yet understand. I want to learn more about it. Maybe I should start a journal for notes about the truth of this world. <laughs> so you can make sense of this world. So you can make sense of the world around you? Make a proof to rationalize everything? This is why you can't have fun. That again. If you want to shut up, make us. Oracle, I need to rest. That sounds familiar. Yeah, I know, I know. I noticed that. I was going to comment on that. Like, it seems like the... Also, blur a cam again. Are you kidding me? Hold up, okay, hold up. I'm gonna fix that. Is it this one? Is it this one? There we go. Let's see. Pop this. Deactivate. Okay, and then we just activate again. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. There we go. I'm so smart. Can't even solve a puzzle. Oracle, I need to rest. Stay quiet for a bit, will you? <laughs> Of course, Miss Eiler. There will be plenty of time for us to talk in the future. That's why you should rest well for now. Soon all will end and all will begin. Would you like to see some progress? Yes. Save.
Mm -hmm. Wait, how many more do I have? Okay, I'm down to 13. Wait, which one was I on? I think it was in this one. In this one? Yeah. My head hurts. I'm pretty sure I hit some hit on something. So it doesn't seem to be any blood, however. Did Hanuka patch me up? Let's thank him. Let's go with it. <gasps> she looks so happy. Find her Felix. Oh, she's probably he's probably dead. <gasps> My boy! He's probably dead now. See, you said they didn't have much to live. Uh oh. Uh oh, oh god, no, not Felix! He isn't there. Oh, oh, Miss Alar. Mr. Benef, what are you doing here? Henry's orders. Where's my Sonicer? And who's in the body bag? Don't tell me, Miss Alar. Like I said, I'm under, under Henry's orders. Do you understand? No, this can't be real. Why? Then grabs my hand. Let's go, you monster. Oh, let's go, you monster. It, it says said, let's go. Let's go, you monster. Who are you taking me? Stop struggling. We're going to the elevators. You leave this place and never come back. We're not your friends, nor we're your lackeys. Felix Honecker was a failed experiment. That's all there was. Don't you feel the slightest remorse? You could have saved him. Remorse? Could have saved? Say hello. Just what you know about me. Then it forced me into the elevator, slams the on the floor button. The doors close behind them. There's an unreadable expression on his face. Oh shit. We're going to the 11th floor, baby! Are we close to the end, by the way? Expand. Because it's like uh, almost 11 pm. I think so, okay, okay. Destination reach, let's go. The buttons don't work. Ah, oh, shit. No turning back now, no turning back! I'm only going forward. Let's go. Let's see what the element floor is. Data transmission successful. Q84. Oh shit. Charlotte, unit Q84. How are you feeling? I feel like shit. What? what why is she in the real world? I, I'm, assuming, I, I'm assuming this is the real world, right? H how the fuck is she in the real world? I feel like shit. Or is she just imagining it? Welcome back. It's been a while. I got up in an instant. What the hell, Charles? What am I alive again? Or maybe it's uh, just this imagination. What am I alive again? I don't really understand myself. But your soul died, I didn't get it deleted. Or maybe this isn't the 11th floor. This might be the 11th floor, actually. It might have something to do with your wish. It was still you who brought me back, wasn't it? But how I noticed this change in my voice's pitch. Something isn't right. Oh god. Whose vessel is this now? Please don't tell me it's Vincent's. It's not, it's a defective Charlotte vessel. Fuck! Can you just let me rest already? Why do you keep doing things like this? Please try to calm down. Calm down, calm down! I want to die, God, I want to die! I don't want any more of this. I hate this place, I hate everyone, I hate you the most. I don't want any more stories, I don't want to deal with any more world conspiracies. I don't want to be in this body for fuck's sake. Please, kill me? This world child, our body is but a mere vessel. Don't give me that shit. Well, you're right, but I'll still blame you for everything. I understand. I'll put you to rest as soon as this is over. However, for now. Please, I need you to come with me. What? Why? Where? You don't understand as soon as we get there. Can you deal with this on your own? Whatever this? I, I can't. I already did what I could. <laughs> so you brought me back because you want my emotional support? Believe me, my corpse will have offered you a better terror possession than I ever will. Is it that bad? Might as well be. <laughs> you really are a loser, God. Too human to be one. <laughs> I suppose I really am. Where are we anyway? We're on the 11th floor. I knew it! We're on the 11th floor. I knew it! The room we need to visit is just a few steps away. Great, I was considering refusing to move and making you drag me there with your noodle arms. I'm perfectly capable of carrying you, Miss Wiltshire. Don't even think about it. Oh shit. Oh shit, but you're playing a Charlotte again. Holy fuck. We're actually playing a Charlotte now. And Charles. I look at the sea star, pretty eh? sure. Oh, sure, it's not the same. But it's just the same as all there. Alright. Twix are blank. Second like side. Twitch frame. Twitch frame is empty. What the fuck is cat? What's that? Drugs. This green glows blue. There's nothing on it. Trash bin is empty. Why is it empty? Also for the sleep on. By the way, what happened to your Vincent vessel? 
Ah, uh, well, I left him alone for a while and came back to a corpse. He killed himself? It's all one big dream! Mm hmm Yeah, that's what they always do. Even though I went through the trouble of implementing a no self-harm rule, talk about wasted effort. Let's bury him later, bury him later okay? Mm. Mm hmm Locked. I'm gonna guess we're gonna win here. This is the place. For God's sake, stop heightening the tension, will you? Your anxiety is contagious. It's just your dad's room, right? So open it already. Alright, here goes. A deep breath and... We're inside father's room. It's quite empty. No furniture, no personal possessions, nothing. In the center of the, center of the room there is a working TV set. Working TV set. I can't see anything. Uh, what the fuck is this? What's that sound? Is there something in here? It's just me and you. And the puppeteer, of course. Well, child. Bingo! Hi there. B19 at your service. That's like the code. That's like one of the codes. The the code I did in the, the, sec, the second puzzle thing, you know? When I needed to use the sign language and the Morse code. B19 at your service. Uh, that sound again. Took you long enough. Been having fun going on adventures with friends. They're not my friends. Yeah, sure. Because Scarlet Island doesn't do friends. Because Scarlet Island is so very serious. Stop making me and come out of hiding already. My, my, you're so eager, you know? What have you been running around? I learned the truths of this world. Want to know what those are, class rep? Stop messing with me. Where are you? You're not fun. But how about I tell you anyway? Bam, lights on. Oh god, what the fuck is that? What in the world is this? What the fuck is that thing? Is that Oracle? Why, it's mother! Our beloved mommy. The one and only true god controlling everything in the house. The one who gave birth to you. What shall you? No, no. Mother is kind, beautiful and understanding. This thing isn't even human. Oh, don't you know? Creators aren't human. All the content comes out of their rare hole. Easy as poop. Poop. This is ridiculous. What are you getting with this? Ah, Miss Isla, you're so impatient. The grand groundbreaking truth of the house is that no one here needs to be saved. This world is an entertainment arena. Mother generates scenarios and provides a constant supply of protagonists. But when one dies, all she has to do is spawn more Charlottes to amuse the spectators. Each 21 is defective. Ha ha ha. Each 21 is defective, what the fuck? You think you'll be saving someone, but they're all with actors on this tiny stage. Everyone gets assigned a role to play. And you're no different. Yeah, right. As if I believe you. This is nonsense. Come here. You get what's coming to you. For every person you hurt. Oh yes, we'll both plead for entertainment. And everyone shall be watching. Want to be the hero? Sure, I can arrange that for you. Mother will bestow you with just the right personality to meet the genre requirements. What the fuck? That thing is actually Mother. Hey, stop having nonsense. I won't fall for your provocation. Right, right. Look, I'm coming for you. I feel my blood boil as she approaches me. Uh, something isn't right. Why do you feel so angry? We're supposed to talk. Yet, why am I? I want to know the reason behind her tears. I want to gouge her out her eyeballs with a bowler knife. I want to understand her. I want to tear out the spine and hang it from the ceiling. Ah! I'll leap forward and tackle her down. Why isn't she resisting? That's right, do it! Shut up! Come on! What are you waiting for? Why, why aren't you resisting? At this rate, I'm really going to kill you! Do it, Scarlet Island! Do it already! And always, always remember, there's not just one person behind the screen. It's thousands. What do you mean? Let me enlighten you. In the world behind the screen, billions exist. That's what the puppeteers are. Oh my god. Are they talking about, like, the world? Like, this world? The real world? There are billions? It's a game for them. They don't care about who you are. All they care about are appearances and whether you're good or evil. Bonus points for porn potential. True. Facts. Porn is nice. Shut your indecent mouth. Except it's truth. Call it. <laughs> no. You're a monster. A demon. Then I know. For sure. Oh, please. 
I'm just another pet pet. One of the many. The silent Charlotte, the sweet Charlotte, the burly, the burly Charlotte. Choose the flavor you like for perfect shipping scenario. Abuse to create an emotional response from the audience. Did you know? Entertainment is dead. It's just one big circle jerk between consumers and producers. The audience wants it raw. Pour your soul into it. More pain, more suffering. Perform. Perform until you break. Become relatable to the max. Hey, Alar. We're so different, aren't we? Except you aren't the protagonist. But that can be overlooked, right? Don't lump it together with the likes of you. Had things turned out differently. We could have been friends, you know. No, in hell. I tap my grip on her throat. She's not resisting. Like I said, soon you'll understand. You be the one crying. I want to be loved. I'm trying so hard, but the world is just unfair. A mother's voice in your head won't stop ringing until you lose your sense of self. Shut up! I'm killed over and over and humiliated for entertainment. There had to be a good girl. Because in order to be loved, I'm not allowed to make mistakes. My head hurts. Why does this particular phrase hurt so much? I'm not supposed to care if my chest tightens. As if from a premono premonition. I open my eyes again. Charlotte Wilshire has long since stopped moving. Ah oh, shit, she actually killed her? God damn. Oh, no way. So easily. She really is dead. So is right, you monster. <laughs> what the hell? This doesn't feel right at all. It's as, if, it's as if I've awakened from a long sleep. Something isn't right. Oh god, what's mother gonna do? Well, hey you are, lamenting a mortal enemy. It's too late. You avenged your dead classmates, aren't you happy? I just want to understand her. Sure, but she's dead now. I, it's it's okay, I can still make everything right. I can do it. Do what? I'll, I'll take your place. I'll find out the truth. Oracle, I have a wish to make. Oh god. This is the only logical conclusion. Oh god. It's, go it's, it's going in a loop now. This is what everything was leading up to. I'll use the Oracle's power to transfer my consciousness into one of the vessels. It really is as you said. But there really are thousands of eyes watching my every step. Oh no. I'm terrified. No, I mustn't falter. I can do it. I'll make the better timeline. I will not become a murderer like her. I'll prove her wrong. I'll prove that free will exists. Even if I break him, break him my mind shadows, this is the only way to find out the truth. Even if I forget what I was looking for, this is the only way I can atone for what I've done. Killing a cycle, yeah. No one will notice the thing. I'm pretty sure, let me see. Then it occurs to me that maybe this was Wiltshire's plan all along. That maybe it was her wish for me to step into her shoes. That maybe I was fated to become her from the very start. This is how her story ends. What the fuck? <laughs> well, 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 what Charlotte should we choose? <laughs> it's like doing grocery shopping. Let's see, <laughs> this vessel will do. Fuck. My world met its end a long time ago. Humanity as I knew it ceased to exist, and disappeared without a single trace. The gods they believed in have died, and churches were built as their graves. The chaos turned into order, and finally became quiet. Now it's blue again, is, is this sea? All I can do is dream for I am so, so tired, but the text isn't white though. Will you be as kind as to join me in dream seeing? Dream seeing. Oh, Charlotte. It's nice to meet you, please take care of me. Oh god, we're back at the beginning again. Oh god, is it just looping? Is this how the game ends? Hope that this is an ending. As for what happened next, you all know all of it, don't you? What the fuck? Oh, that's Felix! And that's... What the fuck? Would you like to say a progress? Another 500 streams to look forward to. What do you mean by 500 streams to look forward to? What the fuck is that? That should be a limit. Okay, well, let's, let's just save it. Mm. Let's save here now. Yeah. What the fuck are we? Oh yeah, well, okay, okay, we're back here now. Well, let me see. Scarlet Isla became Charlotte Wilshire. She used to be cold and calculating. But ended up becoming absent-minded and clueless as her mind crumbled under the influence of Mother's voice. I carefully observed her from afar, and gave her a yellow ribbon to differentiate her from the other Charlottes. Huh. 
So the one we're playing in episode one is different. Wait, was one the episode two? Did she also have a real ribbon? Hold up, let me, let me just check that. Hold up, I, 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 no, no, let me see. I can probably just open. Hold up, hold up. I gotta look that up. Quick, hold up. I, I gotta look that up. If she had a yellow ribbon in the in the second game. Doesn't seem like it. No, she, she had a yellow, uh, she had yellow tie at least. Does that count? Yellow tie? Maybe it is a ribbon. Yeah, she did have a yellow ribbon. Okay, so the one in episode one and two is Scarlet Eiler. A careful observer from afar and gave a yellow ribbon to differentiate her from the other Charlottes. I helped her when she was trapped in the TV world. I'll help you kill Wiltshar again, I told her. That phrase seemed to trigger her memories. She remembered who she really was and horrified her. And we see Scarlet kill herself in episode 2. True! That's true. She understood that she failed to prove V19 wrong, which in turn made her suicidal. Scarlet Isler's story should have ended after she wished to save the Oracle. It should have ended. But the Oracle intervened. They created a channel. It became a world made of Scarlet Isler's soul data. You're familiar with the concept by now, aren't you? Scarlet Isler couldn't believe that the tenants were real. So imaginary they became. She was obsessed with the trial, so it manifested in the world. In my dream, I am the world, huh? How stupid. Why did you go there, anyway? I want to see for myself what the inner world is like. And you end up getting humiliated, beaten up and almost raped by the inhabitants. Congrats. Not only that, you took cosplay to a new level once again by using Vincent's vessel. Yeah, in episode 2. Like, Charlotte saved, saved him, right? And <laughs> still, my journey was rather fruitful. I was afraid of facing her for so long, but when we finally met again, she didn't have the memories of the past anymore. Even though I tried to trigger them so many times, she had no recollection of the past events. She didn't even recognize the excerpt from one of my stories that she used to criticize. She was kind, lost, clumsy, easily fooled, delusional. I can hurt her this time around, I thought, but... When I fell, she helped me get back to my feet. Scarlet Isle will have kicked me until I lost consciousness. When I got hurt, she tended to my wounds. Scarlet Isle will have hurt me even more. When I cried, she tried to reach out to wipe away my tears. Scarlet Isle will have shouted at me. She's changed. So I couldn't hurt her, nor could I help her. Ironically, she couldn't pass the trial herself. Okay, I think I get it. But there's one thing I don't really understand. If you were using Vincent's vessel the whole time, then who was the other you? Yeah, who is he? That's... Hello there, father. What a surprise faces. Is it obvious who I am? I'm set. What? The father of this dysfunctional family. Okay, yeah, 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 okay, I see, I see. It's possible. There's only mother in the house. Oh, really? How long do you plan on rejecting my existence? Miss Wiltshire, be careful. This person is the cognitive version of my father. This is even more powerful than all of us. Easy, easy, I'm not here because of you. Right, because you never cared about me. I will deal with the puppeteer to save the child. To save Scarlet Eiler, now known as Charlotte Wiltshire. As you can see, this TV box is, in fact, Scarlet Eiler's soul, soul cube. Oh. All because Charlotte Unit 091, also known as the Oracle, wanted to preserve her soul down no matter what. The child saved her. And 091 tried to save her in return. Truly the romance of the century, isn't it? However, as a result, Scarlet Eiler's soul now resides in a shabby, shabby TV set. To free her would mean to break this box she's trapped in. That's what it means to save her. You, you bastard, was killing in mother's womb not enough? She was an unwanted child, is all. It's common practice. She should know better than to make a big deal out of it. It was a big deal for mother. That's all that matters. Miss Wiltshire, we have to help her. What's gone into you, Charles? Isn't that the same Scarlet Isla who drove you to suicide? She's not the same. She sacrificed herself, herself for me. Duh, because she has a goddamn martyr complex. I forgave her, Miss Wiltshire. Hey, imposter, can we transfer her soul down to a new vessel? Unfortunately, no human vessel can contain her at this point. Then, what could we... Whatever, I don't care about her. If you had noticed... 
I'm not in the Scarlet Idol fan club. If you don't like the show, just switch the channel for all I care. I'm not sure if that will be the right choice. We don't know what the other channel will be like. It's not like the current channel will disappear either. Won't switching, switching your channel be just an attempt to make us feel better? Uh, so what? Who cares? You seem to be struggling with the final decision. What if we had the puppeteer decide? Say, will you save the child? Mm. Oh, I really want to save her, but... Mm. Mm. I, I did want to save her in episode 2, so I, I still want to save her, like... Uh, uh, I really liked the... Uh, I really liked Scarlet Isler, and I liked Charlotte in episode 1 and 2. So I do want... and... Like, what's the point of this whole journey if we aren't able to save her, you know? Like... Yeah, save her. Let's go. So we chose to save her after all. Like I said before, I prepared everything for the journey. The weapon included. I quite the hammer. Let's go. Hi. Charles, stand back. I'll do it. Miss Wilshire, you don't have to. I said I'll do it. I can't make creation, am I, if I don't carry your burdens? Charles quick, quietly steps back, giving me the hammer. You should wait outside. Just to be clear, that wasn't a suggestion. Alright, I'll come back soon. Yeah, right, you you so will. Now, shoo! Secretly, Charlotte just wants to smash things. Mm hmm. I'm breathing out, so here we are. I'm going to murder the girl who has my face with my own hands. I look at the TV screen. A girl with a yellow ribbon and white eyes stares back at me, as if she knows I'm here. Know what, Scarlet Tyler? As much as I hate to admit it. In the end, Charles, he. He wants you to be born. That's why you became your own person in the house. That's why all the tenants were nice to you. That's why nobody hurts you in this place. You're not an unwanted child. He wanted you to exist. And I want to crush all these regrets. After all, doesn't fiction exist to free the mind? That's why I will crush you too. Swing the hammer. And there will be no war. There will be no revolution. There is no need for it. Our existence is meaningless. But that's okay. There's no need for meaning. We will not fight God. There is no need to. It won't change anything. No matter how wretched we are. No matter how broken we are. No matter how lost we are. We will hold our heads high and march on. Our stories will continue. Well, uh, Jesus Christ. Rest in peace. Welcome to the house. Does it just end there? No. Happen. Oh. Oh. In the heart of the house, there's a bottomless pit. A pit where they slumber. Above the pit, there's a sun that never sets. The black sun sucking all the light in. Wow, it really goes deep. Is she, is she holding someone? Looks like she's holding... Uh, looks like she's holding another version of herself. Is, is that Scarlet Tyler? Wow, it really goes deep. Are you sure there's no accident on the other side of this pit? <laughs> not, not even I know. No matter, no matter how many corpses that drop here, it never gets filled up. Or is it... Uh, looks like C to me. Okay, okay, it's Vincent C. I see. It was a good vessel, wasn't it? Was you supposed to keep him safe? Yeah, I really messed up. In the end, all I did was postpone the in inevitable. No matter what, there's no way I could have helped him. There was no way of fixing him either. Well, duh, you can't go around trying to fix people. There's no way of doing that anyway. I knew that somewhere on a subconscious level, di didn't I? That's why the house is, a, is the way it is. Were I convinced that I could change him, or anyone? They would have ended up being the brainwashed, unnaturally happy versions of themselves. Never once have I wished for that. However, the images of people I knew still became distorted in this place. Especially Vincent's. I was so fascinated with the idea of him, that I failed to see him as a real person. That's why in the house, it's all but an empty shell, an imaginary construct. This place is no heavenly kingdom, after all. Now then. 
He really is gone, isn't he? Goodbye, Vincent. Ah, best boy! We lower him to the pit, and let's go. Then, we hear a small thud. Just something Vincent did Charles throw down here. Uh, at least five. Miss Wolfshire? Yes? There's one more place I'd like to visit, if you don't mind. Oh, I don't have anything better to do anyways. Might as well tag along. By the way, what is that you're holding? Oh, this? It's Mr. Honecker's dimension. Mr. Honecker's dimension? Hmm. Let's see what that is. Is that a... Oh, we're here now. You know Miss Wiltshire? What is it, Charles? Unit V19 believe this world to be made purely for entertainment, but I don't feel like that's the case with the house. During my lifetime in the true realm, I always wanted to be liked by others. Yet somehow, it never seemed to work out. No matter what I did, I was either a ghost or a burden. A kid no one wants to sit with, no matter how good my grades got. Never expressing my opinion aloud, always going along with the flow. Constantly shapeshifting, adapting my personality traits to match others. Saying what others want to hear just so that they will want to be around me. Wanting to connect with others, yet pushing them away as soon as we get close. Repulsed by physical closeness, I drifted away from human contact further and further. Yet somehow, through art and writing, I was able to connect with others in a way that didn't feel repulsive. Miss Verrall, Vincent, I would have never been able to open up to them if it wasn't for my work. However, small and insi insignificant it was. After all, all my life I defined myself with the things I sh could put on paper. So even here, this world subconsciously ended up relying on it. Without fiction, without an appealing protagonist, no one would bother staying in the house. That's how I must have felt. I can only hope for that hope that the puppeteers observing us will forgive this weakness of mine. I forgive you. If it was you, Miss Wiltshire, you surely would have made the ending spectacular, wouldn't you? But for me, the most I can do is come in terms with the loss of my loved ones. Losing Scarlet to father's decision. Losing mother to mental illness. Losing Vincent to delusions. Losing Andre to the distance. There doesn't seem to be an end to my regrets, is there? Now then, back to the purpose of a visit to this room. Hello, mother. Uh, I'm here. Tired, tired. I know. I have a feeling we're actually in in the room in, in the room with this real mother now, you know. And this is just how I see so now. Because she did suddenly just become like you know? Like like all ugly and shit, you know. I know. Charles approaches mother and hugs one of the appendages. You already did the best you could. You gave birth to so many wonderful children. Just like you wanted, right? Uh, everything's okay. You can rest now. With those words, he injects the contents of the syringe she was holding into the mass of organs. Seconds later, everything around us begins to crystallize. Ah! Jesus Christ, the house begins to collapse. Charles, you... You were the last of your kind, Q84. Uh, there'll be no more stories. No more dreams. No more control. At last, we'll be free of everything. No more restrictions, no more fate, no more endings. Wonderful, isn't it? Mother will no longer. Oh god, look at Charles. Holy shit. I think he's weakening. Oh god. It's not even the first time we've seen him break down, and yet... It's okay. It's okay, father. Your world met its end a long time ago. The new one will surely begin from scratch. Humanity as you knew it has ceased to exist, only to make room for a new generation. As long as there are believers, their gods will be reborn, and churches will be built as their sanctuaries. A new day will come, oh my god, it's glitching. Your time will start moving again. There's nothing to be sad about. Well, well, well. Looks like you reached the end of this story. Congratulations! Applause for the winner! It's been a long journey, hasn't it? I hope you... The show after... Just make it... Wait, is it backwards there? 
No, it isn't. Even though the other parts of the cause, I hope you'll forgive me for constantly uh, to your journey um, exciting. Uh, what, what was that? I wonder. In any case, both Charles and Charlotte now truly live up to their names, don't they? Free. However, I won't be staying in this. Having seen so many timelines and not this place, having, having so I've grown bored of outcomes, many timelines and outcomes. Don't you? Don't you? Don't you feel the same? How about you feel the same? How about you feel the same? How about you? What the fuck? Uh, that? Uh, I think the game is crashing. It's kind of horrifying. What the fuck? Uh, can we switch the channel? Ah! Um, hello. What the fuck is in a little black space there? Cool servo. <laughs> um, hello. This is a bit sudden, isn't it? Especially since we haven't talked directly before. You get to spend time with all the other parts of me. With I, the core part, always end up being a side character. I'd rather have it stay that way. But you reached the ending of this story, and there's no one else left to say the final word. So please bear with me for a moment. So here we are. Everyone's gone. The house has crumbled. I fit again for a self-destructive world. In the end, it was no place for all of us to stay. Now that there's no mother, the walls of the house can no longer confine me. However, before I leave, I want to thank you in person. I'm fairly sure this ending wasn't what you wanted. Or what you... What were you... Or what were you here for? After all, in the end, I couldn't become Charlotte Wiltshire. Or Scarlett Eiler. Or proper Vincent Wordsworth. By the way, Wordsworth is a surname. I made it up. I made it up. It has nothing to do with real Vincent. Hmm. Even technically, this game doesn't pack much fun gameplay. All this is frustration. Endless screaming into the void with pent up anger. A disappointing world of a disappointing person. A game with no winners. Yet another world where choices didn't matter. <laughs> okay, so it didn't matter which choice I did. It, it didn't matter earlier when I could pick between my Charlotte or the... Or the uh, white society one. But you still stayed until the end. Through illusions and metaphors, fairy tales and delusions, we were able to have a conversation. And after letting it all out, getting out, getting it out there, I was able to let go of my regrets. Probably not, no. I'll Google that afterwards. Just see if there are other endings. Just because you listened. That's why. Thank you for paying a visit to the house. I hope you enjoyed your stay. Even a little bit. Ah, but I might not be the one you want to hear a thank you from. Let's try it again. Are we gonna see Charlotte, please? Yes! Yes! Yellow Ribbon Charlotte, let's go! Heh, <laughs> long time no see, set. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about you. Together this world may sure I won't. Um, the TV choice does lead to another ending for... Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna check that out in, in, oh, afterwards. I did save right before that. Um, a lot of things happened, but... I'm okay now, really. In fact, I'm really happy. Somehow in the end, everything worked out. I'm at peace with myself. I hope that you're okay, too. I always thought you didn't have any responsibilities other than looking after me. But that was wrong, right? Is there something that's troubling you right now? Or you don't think that you can go on anymore? Please remember that a new day will come. I'm sorry I couldn't stay with you a little longer. It's time for me to move on. That's why. Thank you. Thank you for taking care of me. Let's meet again someday. Uh, my child! Move around. Let's just end there. True end. Goodbye, Charlotte. Uh, Charlotte, no, my child. They're gonna become credits. Oh, what the hell is this? It's a developer. Glad you're here. Special talent. Avoiding social interaction. Passive skill. Hyper focus. Huh. So this is the developer? Cool. This is Henriette. Henriette Varol. The one who cared. Special talent. Social inept. Passive skill. Common sense. Cool. Why are half of them shaking around? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Charles Eiler. The one with many regrets. Special talent. Observation. Passive skill. Cleaning. Vincent. The god of this world. Special talent. Riding. Passive skill. Charm. <gasps> My boy. Felix. Hexer's nephew and a scientist. Special talent. Photographic memory. Special skills, sarcasm. Yep, that's him. Bennett. 
A dedicated worker, special talent, binge watching TV shows, passive skill, high stamina. Florence, an enthusi enthusiastic worker, special talent, engineering, passive skill, high strength. Aiden, Krampus, loyal butler, special talent, taxidermy, passive skill, shapeshifting. Henry Huxley, a scientist and a doctor, special talent, surgery using only a knife and duct tape. Yeah, don't use duct tape when you do soldiers, man. World War Mint. Sean of Wiltshire, Q84. The unwilling protagonist, special talent, acting, passive skill, snark. I'm not sure which one was my favorite, though. Like, I'm not sure if, like, I would say sh sh the Scarlet Charlotte is the most precious one, but. <coughs> Q84. <coughs> God damn it, I've swallowed some one. I've swallowed in the one hole, let me see. Uh, but I really liked Q84 just because of the whole uh, execution hour thingy. I've three Charlotte is hilarious, but it's, it's not a good person. Yeah, correct, correct. She's not a good person, but you enjoy watching her. She's an entertainer, you know? She's entertaining to watch. She's not a good person. I'm, I never said that. She's not a good person. She's a horrible person, but she's entertaining to watch, you know? It's kind of like, uh, I don't know, have you watched Game of Thrones? Like, uh, uh, fucking, what's his name? Uh, uh fucking, yeah, Lannister. Uh, what's his name again? Father to Ty Ty Tywin, Tywin. Haven't yet. Okay, okay, but uh, one of the main bad guys is called Tywin Lannister, and he's a really evil person, but you love every scene he's in because he's always in control. He's just so. And he's, I'm not sure if he's charismatic. I'm gonna say he's charismatic. He's just really like. He, he just knows how to manipulate everything in his favor, you know? And he does it so effortlessly, you know? Anyway. Umbrella Man, Charles, Set, The Entertainer, Special Talent, Omnipotent, Passive Skill, om Omniscient, yeah. Charlotte Wilshire, V19, the one who began it all. Who's this then? Oracle, Frey, O91, the god of the TV world. And then Scarlet Eiler, Charlotte Wilshire, the protagonist of a Hello Charlotte, Special Talent, Doing Your Best. Passive Skill, Determination. <gasps> oh my god, just like an Undertale. Wait, who the fuck is this? <gasps> oh my god, the puppeteer, it's me! It's me! It's me! God, bro, it's me! It's me! Items, though. You need QA4 observation diary. Nice bling. Yeah, man, look, look at that shit. I'm fucking pimping! Yeah! I think it's just like a tight thing. Let me see, you need QA4 observation diary. Is this just the same? Okay, it's just a logs thingy. Never mind. Alright, but let me see. Anything on the wall? Yeah, I was kind of thinking that, let me see. Read that afterwards? Sure. Hello, thank you for playing Hello Charlotte. When I began to work on this project, I didn't think much of it. Just like I didn't think I had the future to begin. Wait. Just like I didn't think I had the future? Like I didn't think I had a future to begin with. Wait, that's just. So all these three years of game development, things change from the better. Fucking I skipped. I almost skipped that. I was able to come in terms with myself. I found a place to belong. I still have to deal with a lot of things, but somehow they became a less heavy in my head. Somehow, they don't seem as hopeless anymore. The final game is a tribute to a certain someone who didn't get a chance to be born into this world. Somehow I came to both love and hate. Someone I wish existed anywhere, somewhere. In the end, Hello Charlotte was a personal story. In it, some events, namely deaths, were entirely metaphorical. Some were so very real. I can only hope that this story was able to reflect the feeling of desperation and hopelessness over losing someone. And the despair of inability to bring them back no matter what. It's a feeling I've been living with for a long time. I feel like I'm constantly fear of experiencing in the future that's to come. If you enjoyed the final episode even a little, I'm glad. If you didn't, that's okay too. If you bought this game and not pirated it, thank you for your support. The info won't go to waste. I bought it. I bought it. I got you, developer. I got you. I got you. Thank you for visiting the house. Let's meet again in the future. Sincerely, at the rain. What would this do? It's just the same. It's the same. So, this is the end. Can I not exit or do I just... I just click quit. Or gallery. Do I have a preacher? Hell yeah. Let's go. 
GG. So there's no way to end it. I'm, I just need to click quit. I'm gonna guess. Title. All right, all right. But let, let's load that. Uh, I think it was this one. Let's load this one. Was this the wrong one? Oh yeah, I'm here. Okay, okay. I was kind of unsure if it was on the right one there because I saw her, her clothes were black. So uh, yeah, let's switch channel now. See what happens now. So they fucked up spot happened. The, the bad ending. Are we ready for bad end? Z at least the text skips really fast. Switch the channel. Are you ready? Oh, I'm sorry. I see. You chose to be selfish. In the end, all you cared about was your own peace of mind. In all honesty, I'm di disappointed in you. Because you turned out worse than I hoped you would. Well done. I'm afraid our ways will part there. Until you re-evaluate your choices and reload the game, that is. Umbrella Man leaves the room. Charles, on the count of three. Alright. We press the button. Um, what is she doing? Are you blind? She's thinking chips, Charles. Wait, did... Maybe we got sucked in the TV wall and she's watching us now. Seeing chips, Charles, all the time? Most of the channels in the house show commercials only. This one might be... Might be not so different. Wait, want the security cameras? So the channel where she doesn't even have a story? Hey, her story might be about eating junk food. Fuck yeah! And look at my cat. My cat is so precious. Stop it, Miss Wolfshire. It's not funny. You think? I find it hilarious. Just look at her. Can't fake that smile. She seems happy. Blissful, even. Yeah. Look at her bringing the food with... Oh. Looking at her binging the food with no key on the world, I feel the bile rise in my throat. I didn't expect anything, yet why is it so frustrating? This can't even count as a happy ending. In a fit of sudden anger, I switch the channel. What the f oh god! She hung herself. Again. Oh god. And again. Oh god. She got eaten by demon. Oh god. Charles catches my hand. Miss Wilson, stop it! God damn it. Why can't we do anything? I'm sick and tired of feeling powerless. Why is your world like this? Can we go back to the first one? Yeah, same. <laughs> and don't you sorry me. I uh, know, no, okay. We both frustrated. But there's really nothing we can do. Not all problems can be solved. Not all things can be fixed. It's something we have to live with. No matter how much it frustrates us. I never asked to be born. It always should have been her. His father chose me. Him and mother were already a part of that time. It is still chose to let me live. So I'm constantly trying to make up for everything Mother has lost. For everything breakdown she had. For every time she would call the ambulance. For every time she cried. Nothing else matters. And now, look at this world. Repetitive, meaningless, futile. It's almost laughable how unoriginal my stories are. None of you deserve this. I can't even die here. Trust me, I've tried. Charles, let's leave this room. Are you sure we? I'm sure. We leave this place and return to the first floor. I'll rebuild white society and have it do something worthwhile for a change. Ooh. If Allah can't be contained in one vessel, we can use thousands, right? You want to make videos out of them? I guess, whatever. This is be a hell of a selfish actor, so that's where the videos came from? No, honestly, I don't think Miss Wiltshire would be happy if we save her. That's true. Like I said, no matter what we do, there will be no right answers. The house is essentially self-destructive. Still, it's better than watching you rot away in self-pity, you loser god. So what if four more Scarlet now... Uh, oh, so what if four more Scarlet now... Now Charlotte doesn't want to get out of her little fancy box. I'm bringing her here and watching the house... Wait. I'm bringing her here and watching the house burn as we eat a monthly supply of Charlie's junk foods in one sitting, period. Wait a minute. Did you just... Didn't you want me to put you to rest? I changed my mind for now. Don't make a big deal out of this. I, Father. I get it, so... Please. And so we leave the room. Inside the room, there's a box. Inside the box, there's a channel. Inside the channel, there's a world. Inside the world, there's a girl. A girl who's the world itself. Hello, world. How are you? Oh, there's the credits. What the fuck? 
Huh. So we just leave her. That's kind of sad. GG number two. Anonymous 420. The fucked up beat. Scripts. Special thanks. EMS. And you. Thanks. No problem, game, game developer. So I want to look back and see what happens if I choose EMS. EMS wasn't all this anymore, were they? Oh, wait. Dear friends, oh my god, after, after credit scene. Today we are gathered for a very special occasion. Hopefully not execution hour. Today is the day we ascend. Right, Mr. C? Precisely, Miss Wildshire. Today we shall make history. Please, put on the helmets in front of you. At last, we shall become pure white. Oh god, what's happening? Come on with the hamster? Yeah, no, 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 the hamster, EMS. Uh, that was actually the first thing I thought about. But I was thinking, nah, that can't be it, you know. But that's what the hamster is uh, named after. I see. Eltshire. Miss Wiltshire. Pray. It's time for us to go. Where to? Stargazing, of course. Stargazing is alive, Pray. Just like everything Umbrella Man said. No, everything is for real this time, promise. Promise. Come now, take my hand. Let's lead the story together. Lead the way. It's kind of om om ominous. I messed up. Hmm. Happy childhood's end. I got an achievement called Childhood's End, which is the name of the game. Maybe this is the canon ending. Save your puppet soul, then? Sure. There. Oh god, what the fuck happened? Uh What do I do? What do I load? Do I load that? Do I load this? What happens if I load this? Looks fine to me. What do you mean by looks fine to me? Okay, I'm trying to load it, but it doesn't work. It doesn't do anything. Hmm. Uh... Hold up, I gotta Google this. Uh, hello, Charlotte. Charlotte and... Uh, what the fuck do I even Google that? There's no cell data left to load. I guess... Anyway, let, let's... Let's load to... I think it's this one. Where is this one? Let's try to load this one. Or this one. Well, let's load this one. Fuck it. I wanna see what happens if we pick the white society on. Just gonna skip. This is gonna, this is gonna just take a few minutes, I think. I just wanna see if, if something happens if I pick the white... If I pick Q84. You see, it was number 13 before. Uh, yeah, I, I thought so, but I, I, I'm pretty sure if I load that, I can just press new game, you know. I'm, I'm, I'm unsure if I can just pick 13 though. I'm not sure if it's said before or after the choice, you know. It might have been, it might have said after the choice, you know. Like, I haven't, I, I, I don't know, man. Anyway, it's just gonna take a few minutes to get to where we were, you know. So we just skip. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, I've seen this before. I'm beginning. The white society. Okay. Oh my god, yes, execution armor! Woo! <laughs> Let's go, execution armor. Let's go. Throwback Wednesdays. Yay! Damn, we couldn't even get to the best part of the song. Mm, almost there. Mm. Skip, 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 skip. I should go turn back time to the good old days. Mm. All this emotional storytelling, lost in the blink of an eye. Yep. 
Chapter 3 end. Let's all kill the Scarlet. Well, special item. Wait, what? Seize Observation Journal. Wait, did, did I get that earlier? Okay, I think I got that earlier, right? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. you did. Okay, okay. Oh, you must. Here was the same point. Never mind. I, I didn't need to skip all that. Never mind. I'm just gonna. Wait, what? Can, can I not load that? Yes. There we go. Uh, Q84 is more important. Oh my, really? This grumpy sociopathic show off? The one who used mob mentality as a psychological weapon to manipulate the students? Wow, call me impressed. You must have many questions as to why why have I led you to this particular sort of unit? Q84 and I got an achievement. Q84 enthusiast. You must have many questions as to why I've led you to this particular story to begin with. But do believe me, it's vital to understanding everything that will happen from now on. You surely didn't think that we were going to travel in time and change the outcome of prior events, did you? The average Q84 enjoyer. Hold up, I'm gonna find an image. Let me see. Hold up. What is that? Oh. What the fuck is. There we go. Let's get a. Don't want this. Not sure if I can just do this. Let me see. Hold up. Hold up. I think you can add image, right? Let me see. Where is image? Add. Add existing source. What? Is it? What? Hold up. Oh no. Add new source. Sure. Where the fuck did it go? I think it's just this. There we go. There we go. This is the average a average uh, Q84 player. Enjoyer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just gonna put it there. Or should I just cover my uh, camera with it? There we go. There we go. New new new, new face cam. New face cam. New face cam. Q84 enjoyer. You surely didn't think that we were going to travel in time and change the outcome of prior events, did you? Okay, I'm gonna remove it, sorry. Well, well how, do, how do I remove this? There we go. You surely didn't think that we were going to travel in time and change the outcome of prior events, did you? Because if you did, that would be rather unfortunate after all. Like I have said before, there's no such thing as rewinding time in the house. One story ends, a new one begins. It's an endless cycle of life. Now it goes with games, you can always start a new one. And now here. What happens if I click new game now? Something that different happen? Uh, what the fuck is this? Whoa. This makes me so uncomfortable. Well, this is horrifying. You've probably seen everything different now. Yeah, I have. What the fuck is this? And they're all staring directly at me. This is so horrifying. Stop screaming. We're having fun. Oh, this is looping, okay. Uh, do I just exit? Just exiting. Let me see, what happens if I reopen it? I got 12 out of 14 achievements, which one did I miss? Oh, I forgot. Oh, uh, okay, I haven't, I didn't use link queue on C apparently, and... Uh, monster. You don't want to play, I destroy research. Oh, I... 30% <laughs> of players destroyed uh, Felix's research. Wait, how many... 32% uh, were Q84 enthusiasts. 25.8% uh, pushed Andrew into the pond. Wow. <laughs> Let me just look, what the, what's the uh, rarest achievement? Okay, the rarest one is, uh, didn't use Honnickerpedia even once. 28.1%. Interesting. 
But let me try to open it up the game again. One last time. Okay, so the game... It, is it even possible to... Just loads back to this. Freaking horrifying. <laughs> Sorry. L l let me... Let me see, what happens if I... Hmm. Can I probably nuke a file or redo the ending? Yeah, probably. Yeah, what happens if I redo the ending? Good point. Let me see. Is it... I think it's this one, right? Nope, okay, not that one. Hold up, it was 14, this one. Let me see now. If I re redo this... Oh yeah, new game after the true end would be interesting. That's a good point, I don't think it... Did I do that? Or does it just start over like normal? Fucking hell, I forgot to check that, but at the same time, I don't think that... I don't think anything's gonna happen there. But let's check it out. One way to find out. One way to find out. Saber. Jesus Christ, man. But that's fucking horrifying. Make it... Make it the game unplayable and just make every character... Like, an eerie red color and looking directly at you. At the screen and screaming like... Ah! You know? That's fucking horrifying. That's definitely the most uncomfortable part of the game so far. Holy fuck. Ah. That really made me uncomfortable, man. I don't change anything. Basically a control landing, but with more art. Control landing, what was that again? What was the control landing again? Was that from episode 1 or episode 2? Wiping out everyone's ego. I guess. Maybe, yeah. Ah, the control ending. But... Was that, yeah, because that, there was a white, grey and black ending. So which one was it? They were all talking in one voice. I think that was the... That was the... I don't think it was the white ending. I thought that might have been grey ending. Don't read that one below. Speed! Speed! I'm killing mother. I'm sorry, mother. Die, mother, die! Die! Die, mother, die! Sorry. <laughs> But this is on the way to like at the end of this ending, like you get to this area of the. Uh, just that sound. We have to pick the other choice somewhere. Is it aren't we just looking at the characters and stuff at the ending? Like how how do we exit that area? I gotta see if there's any way to do it. Or do we just quit? Maybe we should save. I gotta look at that. Let me see. Or maybe I need to save over that file somehow. Quit to title, I'd imagine, maybe. Yeah, but we can't hope them to see. see now. Okay, hopefully I'm here soon, I'll see ya. What do we just get sent back to? Okay, okay. Ah, I just realized now. I was kind of worried, I was kind of thinking, who is the character that's missing here? But we, we were standing there. Can, can we interact with ourselves? Save. Let's save. This one. Hopefully that's good. Nah. What is there a way to exit? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, guess quit. To title. Please don't... Oh, what the fuck? That scared the shit out of me. Adder Solutions. Has a solution for you. Free ad. What the fuck is this? Fuck. New story? What happens now? Is this or is it gonna be the same? Yep, still the same. Uh... Oh boy. Uh... Okay, that's terrifying. Yeah, but isn't it still the same? Isn't it the same as earlier? What? What do you mean by okay, that is terrifying? Uh... This is still the same though. 
It's happening here too on the good end. Yeah. What does it mean? I don't know. I guess the game is selling me I had one shot and I fucked it up. I don't fucking know. Ah! Fuck. Uh, people screaming makes me want to scream, okay? But look at this menu though. Look at this shit. Look, it's uh, Aiden. What happens if I load the... Uh... Load the puppet there one. So unconfirmed, it can be conjectured that these may be the white society members tapped to collectively contain Charlotte's Scarlet's ego in the happy ending. That would explain some things. Yeah, that would explain some things. And then they went mad. Probably. Okay, let me just say, okay. I think this is a good place to be instead of the main menu. When I'm ending this. So uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything else to uh, I don't think there's anything else to look at here. I'm pretty sure I'm done with the whole game, maybe? Or oh, there was a DLC, right? How long was the DLC, though? That would cost also the same amount, right? Let me see. Or oh, two DLCs, technically. Let me see. Shall oh. Hello, Charlotte. Let me see. Heaven's Gate. Delirium, another one. How long is Heaven's Gate though, does it say? Hmm. None of the reviews are giving anything. Hmm. 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 Amazing addition to the main Hello Charlotte story, but also an independent storyline that carries a message of its own. Hmm. Okay, it says it says that it's a vision level, is it? Yes, yeah, a vision level. Oh, okay. Huh. Interesting, it's a vision level. Oh, I was re I was reading time for the means. It, it literally says in the uh, in the Steam page about this content. For the minutes. But what about the other one though? Where can I... Hello Charlotte... What was it called again? Delirium? Delirium? Uh, we're gonna play that though. Was it a vid? Let me see. Hello Charlotte, let me see. A short spin-off game, but... Where can I get the game though? Uh, what the fuck? Is it on Steam? I don't think it is. It doesn't seem like it's on Steam. Let's clear unmarked spoilers, right? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to dodge that shit. Let's see. Maybe if I go to. Hey, everyone. Okay, I found Mally Bass Heroes one. Let's see. First and second, here's Sherlock Holmes. For the most part, the plot is stand like kind of goofy. Gameplay list, game info. Well, I just find it on uh, it. Uh, okay, okay, it's it's on the it's on the page. See, it's short though. Yeah, it says uh, about half an hour long. Okay, okay. Now available in Spanish, Polish, and Chinese. Nice. Warning: the game has chase scenes. Cool. Oh, and it seems like you're playing as uh, as Scarlet. Uh, uh, Charlotte, you know, the rich, the, the one we love and throw, the one we love. Uh, oh, in this world, puppeteers do not exist. In a two-dimensional world without morals, what kind of girl will Charlotte be? Have fun and bon appetit. Cool. But yeah, we can probably play that next time. Bo both of those. So I think next stream is going to be... I, I can probably just play tomorrow, you know? I think it's just gonna be an hour or one and a half hour stream, like a really, really short one. That way I can just take a little short break afterwards, you know? Mm, since I've been streaming. Wait, how many days have I been streaming? Let me see. I streamed on Tuesday and Wednesday, right? Yeah. Same PS again? Yeah, that sounds good. I think that sounds good. So, wait. Oh, oh, name your own price. Oh, I can, like, Donate, is that it? Since there's no lot. Name your own price. Yeah, I should probably play it first before I donate anything. But uh, yeah, we'll see how good it is. 
Hmm. We'll just look at something. What's that? There's a free download option too, but yeah. Yeah, I know it is a free download, but it said name your own price, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll see how much I like it. How much I enjoy it. Because if I feel like it's... It's either bad or uh, not worthwhile or anything, then I won't donate, you know. But if I feel like it's worthwhile, I'll give, I'll give them a dollar or two, you know. We'll see, we'll see. And then there's the vision log, which I have to download. Oh, buy, I mean. Buy. I am buying it on Steam. Chill, 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 chill. I all bought all at once. Hmm, let me see. What's the minimum requirements? Intel Pentium. Nice. Half a gig of RAM. 200 megabits available space. And the direct X compatible sound card. Cool. Alright, alright. I think I got that covered. But yeah. Pretty wacky games, let me just say that. Like, holy fucking shit. I'm not sure if the whole the story in its whole made... Like, it made sense, but also it didn't make sense, but... Uh, the developer explained here in the afterwards that... Oh, like, the characters and the game developer said it didn't really matter. Like, it was just a... It's the, its own project, you know? Like, they just want to... Uh, they just want to make something in, in, in a difficult time in their life. So, I'm, it's definitely creative, let me just say that. And pretty special. So, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna have to go and look at YouTube videos to see... To, to see if there was stuff I missed. Uh, there's definitely stuff in episode 1 and 2 I missed. Since I didn't know that the one in episode 1 and 2 were, uh, was this Scarlet, you know. So I definitely have to go back and look at that, you know, and stuff. Uh, but uh, yeah, it was fun, it was fun. So uh, yeah, again, I'm gonna play the... I'm gonna play the extra content tomorrow. It's gonna be a short stream, an hour or an hour and a half, something like that. And uh, then I'll take... Then I'll see if I take a, a day break or something like that. Or if I'm gonna jump right into the next game. Yeah, this was great. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty great. Because I was either thinking about... Uh, I don't know, have you heard about the game Night in the Woods? Uh, thanks for streaming again. No problem, man. Because I was thinking about streaming Night in the Woods, but I was also thinking about playing Elden Ring. Like, I haven't played Elden Ring yet. But I just got a new graphics card, so... I have never played that one. Yeah, I, let me just say, I have played that one. But... There have been updates to the game. So, uh... Hmm? Which one? What do you mean by- Oh, oh, a graphics card. Hold up, I can get it. Yeah, this. Watch out if you can see it. RTX. This is. This is it. Let me see. Hold on. Can you, can you see it? Totally 70 Ti. So that's nice. I'm gonna. I didn't wanna. I didn't wanna install it before I was done with the stream though, because. A 70 Ti? Dang. Yeah. I, I, I did want a 3070 though, because I heard 3070 Ti was really not. actually not worth it, but. I couldn't find. One that was worth it because it was like a hundred still in a 1070. I'm on a 1080 Ti, <laughs> so uh, I've had my card for five years now. Yeah, you take what you can get nowadays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And okay, so let me just check out how much stuff is worth. Oh, let me see. You're, you're using euros, right? Because you're in you're in Netherlands, right? Let me see. Let me just convert Norwegian crowns to euros. Let me see. No uh, calculator. Let's see. Yeah, 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 I'm saying. Uh, because uh, the 2070 Ti cost 11,000 Norwegian crowns or 1,115 euros. And it, I was thinking, okay, maybe I should upgrade from 2070 Ti to 3080, you know, instead. Because I heard 3080 was more worth it. But on, on Norwegian stores, it cost 16,000 Norwegian crowns, which is 1,600 euros. There's a 500 euro difference between a 3070 Ti and a 3080, and you only get like 10 or 15 frames extra. And uh, the difference between a 3070 Ti and a 3070, yeah, you really have to watch price like a hawk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and by the way, this is like on on uh, hardware stores, by the way. Th this isn't on uh, eBay or something like that. This isn't from a scalper. This is from the store. The hardware store. We got a, a website called called the, the price guide, basically. 
and the, the cheapest ones you find are uh, like for the 2070 ti was 11 1100 euros and 2070 was 1000 euros so it's like eh. i got a 2080 ti for 1200 a while back msrp i think but send it back it was a terrible model oh shit that sucks uh, th yeah, 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 that, uh, let me see, I haven't seen anything come close to that since, holy shit. But for 1200 euros, holy fucking shit. 105C on the VRAM and the lighter gaming loads. Jesus Christ, that's hot. Holy fucking shit. Uh, but I did actually buy a graphics card last year. I got a MSI 6800 XT, you know, the equivalent to an RTX 3080. But it only, like, when I connect, let me see, a Ventus? Uh, no, not Ventus, uh, let me see, what's it called again? Let me see, I, I gotta, I gotta find my order, hold up, I'm gonna log in, go into my hardware account, let me see, my orders, let me see, I got it for 999 euros. Uh, Gaming X Trio, it's called. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, I got an, a 60, 60 MSI Radeon RX 6800 XT Gaming X Trio. The trees are solid. Yeah, and it costs 900 euros when I bought it. But now it costs 1,400 euros. That's like holy fucking shit. It increased by 500 euros from when I bought it. And I was really lucky to get the last one when it was 900 euros. But it was a defect. It was defected. I sent it back to the hardware store and they couldn't figure it out. They, they couldn't figure out how to fix it. So they had to send it back to MSI. And then I got my money back. And I just sat like, what's wrong with it? I don't fucking know. I, I think I troubleshooted it for like three or four days. And I asked my brother, who is like an IT guy, like a hardware guy, to try to fix it. And none of us could fix it. Like, the thing, the, the thing that was wrong with it was the fact that every time I turned my PC on, it only lasted for one hour before uh, before the graphics card stopped working. And uh, there's a red light on the motherboard that starts lighting up, that's basically saying that it can't detect the graphics card. And another thing that's kind of weird is the fact that it only lasts one hour on a 1080p screen. The moment I plugged in a 4040p screen, it lasts for 15 minutes. And if I dual screened, it lasted Maybe a minute, maybe a minute. It was cut, it's really weird. So the, the, the less resolution it worked on, the longer it lasted, you know? So if I turn the resolution down to the lowest, dual screen generally means higher clocks, yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, it could be a marginal power supply, but that's weird. I got an 850 watts power supply, like that's... Let me just see what's the recommended va voltage is, let me see. 600 XT. Uh, power supply recommendation. I think it's. I think 850 is recommended, isn't it? Uh, recommendation. What's the recommendation? Fucking hell, I can't write. What the fuck is recommendation? Uh, a good one? Yeah, I think I got a good one. Like, my brother picked it, and he knows what he's doing, so I assume he knows what he's doing. Let's see, yeah. I think there's a ton of cheap ones that pay, say, 850, but go full fireworks and push the hard. Uh, what the fuck is this called? Like, the problem is like that I didn't, like, the power supply I have now, I bought it in 2016 or 2015. And, uh, I'm no, I think it's Corsair though. Corsair 850, let me see. Corsair Gold, I think, something like that. Corsair Gold 815. Let me see, is it this one? Let me see. Uh, not sure, not that one. Let me see. It was Corsair though. Let me see, Corsair 850 Gold? I think it was something with gold. Or, or maybe it was just the Corsair RM 850. It might be that one. Because uh, you, you can like, let me see, Corsair had a few bad models, but it should be fine in general. Yeah, I don't see any problems with that. Like, my 1080 Ti have worked perfectly. And uh, as I just said, I I did send the I did send the graphics card back graphics card back to back to the hardware store, and they couldn't figure out what was wrong with it. And I assume they have a bigger and better power supply than I do. So 
yeah, if they if they can't figure that, then yeah, I assume it's it's fucked, you know. But uh, yeah, so uh, now then, that was the stream. I'm gonna eat, plug in the new graphics card, install it, and then I'm gonna go to, go to bed. Or maybe I should just go to bed now and install it tomorrow. I don't fucking know. Uh, and the drivers tend to be more polished, anyways. Enjoy the new car. Thanks, thanks, man. Hopefully this one won't fuck me over, you know. But uh, yeah, I was thinking about. I was thinking about streams. I was thinking about either playing Elden Ring or Night in the Woods. Like, uh, but did you? Had you heard about Elden? Or uh, not Elden Ring, but uh, did you say you had heard about? Uh, and I played. I have never played. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You had heard about uh, Night in the Woods. But as I was saying. Uh, uh, I've played it before, but it was back in 2017 when it came out. And, uh, but there's, there could be like a few updates. Like, not not huge updates that changes the game or anything, but like, there are a few bonus content here and there. So, I would like to try that. Um, the story itself isn't really that good, but the characters are just so beautifully written, in my opinion. If that makes sense. So uh, yeah, I definitely want to play that on stream, but I also want to, but I also want to play Elden Ring since I got the new graphics card, you know. So I'm definitely going to stream that one day, but I'm not sure when. I kind of been waiting and see if they can fix the PC version. So we'll see, we'll see. I might play Elden Ring this week. I might play Night in the Woods. We'll see, we'll see. Maybe I'll maybe I'll start with Elden Ring first before Night in the Woods. So, Elden Ring, I'll give it a miss. Waiting for it to drop in price a bit. Eh, I see. Understandable. Like, I haven't played any Souls game, by the way. Let me just say that. We will drop by if I see something fun, for sure. Yeah, I, or I haven't played Bloodborne, but I only got to the first or second boss. I got to, uh, like, a hunter guy, and I got really fucking mad. I almost broke my controller, and I was like, fuck this guy. I'm not gonna kill him, and then I'm gonna drop the game. And then I did that. I killed him, and I dropped the game. <laughs> Sigma L grind set. <laughs> but yeah, definitely gonna play Bloodborne again too. But uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see which one I play first, either Elden Ring or Night in the Woods. I might like switch around between them because Elden Ring is like a hundred hours while Night in the Woods is only 12 hours, you know? So yeah, we'll see, we'll see what I do. We'll see, we'll see. Anyway, I think I'll end the stream here, and we'll continue by doing the DLC tomorrow at 7-ish 7, 7 p.m., you know, so... Yeah, it's been fun, it's been fun. So, yeah, thanks for watching, it's been fun. The stream was way longer than I expected, I, I thought it would be done like an hour or a half ago, but... I was also really stuck in the puzzle and stuff. So, yeah, thanks for watching. See you next stream tomorrow. So, bye-bye.